Yo guys, it's Huss. Disclaimer for this episode, there was a lot of technical difficulties which caused for the focus on the camera to be off. We didn't want to miss a week of posting on YouTube, so we decided to post it like this. For future, will be patterned. And yeah, make sure you listen to the full episode on Apple and Spotify. Love. Oh yeah, by the way, gala like wicked. Me and Mr. Arn got along so good. Have you been getting these sex yes, people? Yes, bro. Mentioning your stories. Mentioning your stories, bro. Jarring. Damn, many people have blocked. It's jarring. I don't know how to even, like, stop it. Nah, I can't. It's, an, it's, a, it's definitely like a what, hack like, or something, yeah. It's annoying, man. What's this guy doing? When I had um, an idea the other day, it wasn't really an idea. It was just like, just talking well thinking to myself and the question came up and I was like like some people they're on a vibe of record everything because memories is what you're going to have at one point in it you want to live relive through that and whatnot. some people are like don't record everything because like if your phone's out during certain moments you can't enjoy it to the fullest to the max to the fullest you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying my thing is where's the balance how do you get the best of both worlds? I don't really know. I feel like if you experience it with other people, you don't really need to get your phone out. Because it can come up in conversation years down the line. Oh, do you remember when this happened? Did it? And they remember. Whereas if you, you can always take memory, you can always take photos and videos, but I just feel like if you're with a lot of people, like that's enough. Everyone's got that memory. Everyone will remember it. You will never forget it. But I don't know. I don't know. I have a different viewpoint on that. I feel like taking videos, taking pictures is the best way to remember a memory or to store that memory, if anything, really. Like what you said about if you're with people and you experience it together, that's that's cool as well, but Things like now, if I travel to, I don't know, Bali, of course I'm going to take a picture. Yeah. Of course I'm taking going to take a video. Even if I experience it with someone, I'm going to take a picture and video. So I always have that. So I can always treasure them as well. In terms of where's the balance, I would say it's not everything you have to record, but only certain moments. Like, let's say I propose to someone. I don't know. Would I record that? Would I get someone to record it? I don't know, maybe. But for me, the balance is where posting it. I don't need to post it. Yeah. That's my balance. So I can record it, but it's for me. And you get me? That's it, really. That's my balance. Yeah, you got to... Because, I mean, if you look at secondary, like, you might think how many conversations you've had where it's like, oh, remember when? Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? There might, not be a, there might not be footage of that, but... Everyone can remember the same story, which is what you're talking about. And yeah. everyone's like reminiscing X, Y, Z. Yeah, but then the stories get funnier when someone drops an old picture of someone that has a shit haircut. Yeah, yeah. True. True. yeah. But that's something you have to take a picture of, though. Like, you're not going to miss anything if you don't take a picture of Do you know what I mean? Like you said, um, um, if you're videoing it or taking a picture of it, you're not experiencing it fully. Yeah. Well, that's in certain situations. Because I remember there's someone that had a bad haircut in our group chat one time in secondary school that yeah. everyone saw. I was the only person that never saw it. You I, never saw it? I never saw it. I know bro. exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, but yeah, I never saw it. And I everyone, like I know as well. Yeah, so everyone makes the same joke that, yeah, he had a bad hair. I was like, bro, I, I never saw this. It's the worst haircut I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, I never saw it. <laughs> 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 what trim was it again? Bro. Apparently he just tried to like trim a, himself, like innit? Did himself, in it. Yeah, he tried no, to trim I himself. I had, I had a different story, but yeah. We'll talk well, like, his dad cut it or something like that? No, no, no. He tried to trim himself. Like, he tried to do his hairline. But he just shagged it, innit? That's what I... Well, that's what he said, anyway. I was gonna do that, actually. Like, in lockdown, when there was no barbers, I was like, you know what? Let me just take a chance. Oh, God, I wasn't I wasn't brave enough. You can learn. I don't... I haven't done it, but... You can learn to do it. And that's actually a good skill to have. Like, if you can do your own hair, you can do, like, your son's hair and stuff like that. How do you do it, though? Like, how do men actually shape themselves up? Bro, you I shape need, myself. You need them. What? Oh. Yeah, you can shape yourself. So you, are you lying? No. I've been shaping myself from time. Like, like just the front or that. like all the way around? No, like what you can see. So here. Yeah. yeah. 
I don't really touch this, but if I want to touch it, I'll touch it. But you know. I swear. Yeah, I used to do my brothers as well. That's how I learn. I'm not a professional. Like, I wouldn't go and do it for a motive, but yeah, like, if uh, I wanted to touch up, I'll touch up. Makes was, sense. But yeah, no, my balance is like, I feel like there's certain people or there's certain moments where you're enjoying yourself so much, you don't even feel the need to bring your phone out. Yeah. In that moment, I'm not going to record because it's like, I might not enjoy it as much if I now bring my phone out. Mm -hmm. I might miss something that I wouldn't have missed if I didn't bring my phone out. You know what I'm saying? In them moments, in those moments, nah. Um, but in a moment where I feel like, nah, like 20 years time, I want to look back and remember this, I might record it. Like, mm -hmm. Uh, I don't know. I feel like our part, I, I wouldn't um, bring my phone out at a party and be recording it to post on social media. Unless, not, yeah, not unless, post. yeah, unless like someone's performing or something like that. Cause like, you're not really enjoying the moment if you're recording it at the same time. You know what I'm saying? You're kind of half focused on making sure you've got a good recording instead yeah. of enjoying everything around yeah. you. So, I mean, again, I hear it, but for example, now I went to Odile's concert, or we went to Odile's concert yeah. last week, whenever it was. That was lit. I have recorded better of it. Fair enough. And I experienced that to the fullest. Because one, that's an artist that I wanted to see. And yeah. two, recording is something that can, you know, when Snapchat gives you a throwback of last month, boom, it's there. Yeah. When it gives you a year recap, it's there. Two years, three years, it's there. So for me, it's like, but I didn't post that a single bit. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like, with when someone's when someone's performing, you record. Yeah, it's different. Do you know what I'm saying? But like, if it's a a, a normal party, are you gonna record everything? Are you gonna record every time you go to a party? Like, and post you can Snapchat take snaps like of that, it, I guess. Yeah, because there'll be certain parts. In a party where like you want to snap something because it's funny and send it to the man them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like you're not gonna walk around with your phone the whole like throughout the whole house like recording that. Like, you're not gonna do that. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. But what's this? Because I, I I get why you asked this because I feel like there's a not a stigma but there's a sort of thing where like people keep on saying you don't need to record everything or stuff like that. Well, I don't know. Maybe because I watch YouTube a lot back in the day now, where. Couples would be, be like, oh yeah, you don't need to record this or this and that. I thought with that, that's a bit different. But in terms of just my day to day, yeah, I don't see what the problem is with recording. Mm. No, like recording your day to day. That's in fact no, like one of my one of my most like favorite TikToks is like people that just snap their their day in the day life. In the life. Yeah, I find that so interesting. I find it interesting, but I can't lie to you. Half of them, you know, when they'll they'll snap it and it'll be like, oh, I wake up at five a.m. I asked them if they woke up at 5 a.m. the next day. They didn't. They didn't wake up at 5 a.m. the next day. Now, Maybe some, some of them some do. Some, some of them do, innit? But do, innit? Yeah, but yeah, I enjoy watching those as well. Yeah. And there's a thing where like, I don't know if I do it myself, but I like seeing it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Talking about TikToks now. I hate the TikToks where, not hate them, but like, it's funny when I see TikToks where like, they're trying to record day in the life now. And... It starts off with them getting out of the bed, stretching like this. Yeah, because you know they set up the set camera. Up the yeah, camera. Yeah, 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 trust. Yeah. I see, that's, you didn't just wake up. I feel like that's sort of what's wrong with social media that, as well. That, that is yeah, so like, funny. They're trying like, to make it too real. Like. Yeah, 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 like that, that is funny. That's the one TikTok I'll be like, yeah, you're a dog. Or like they're walking past the street. Yeah. And you know they must have put their phone there, walked back and then walked past the phone. Like, yeah. yeah no, yeah, it's yeah. funny though. It's content though. It is. To them it's like, I'm making content that will look mm -hmm. realistic. Which is why I get it, but it's like sometimes you're like, come on, you set the camera, got it back in bed, woke up, pretending you were still sleeping, woke up, like, come on. Well, obviously, sense, I'm not hating though, but you know. Yeah. That's, 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 those TikToks are funny still. In terms of like, taking pictures and stuff, how, am I, how are you man with like PDA and stuff? What's your limit? What's my limit with PDA? Yeah. As in public display of affection? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So in terms of relationship? Yeah, bro. As in, wait, hold on. What's There's your max? Little, what's what's your max, bro? <laughs> exactly. Like, what's why the you, limit you what do you need? What's no, the clarification? What clarification do you need? <laughs> you start off with taking pictures and PDA. Yeah. Because so I think- In terms like, of taking pictures of PDA- Yeah. With my, with my partner. Yeah. 
Oh. I was, I was actually trying to break it down it's with a, It's you. a two-part question, like. That's what I'm saying. Isn't but taking you, pictures in public with your partner PDA? No, 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 no. Like, so let's say like you're just practicing PDA. She yeah. takes a picture of it. And then yeah. PDA itself. Yeah. What are you comfortable with? Oh. As so like, so you knew it was a question. It was a long winded question. Though, understood, though. I understand. I understand it now. Not exactly. It was long winded. So I was like, which one? Yeah. yeah. So it's two part. Cool. I have no issues with taking pictures with my girl. That's the first part, right? Yeah. PDA is a bit different for me. I don't like to like it as much. Yeah. At all. Like not even holding hands. What is it? I would do it. I got no issues with holding her hand. But naturally, it's not in me to want to do PDA. But again, if she asks man to lip so. Where? On public? Yeah, I'll do it, innit? I've never been in that situation. Uh-huh. I can do it in public, but it depends on how public the place is. Public is public. No, what? no, no. Like if there's a few, like if... If you're no, public ain't public. Yeah, public ain't public. Like I'm not gonna do it in, in the middle of Oxford Street. Okay. Like, I'm not gonna, Obviously, okay. But mm. if I'm with a at a bus stop or something or a train station that's barely anyone there, maybe, maybe all it has is not that deep. So um, that count as public though, like it is, you're outside. It's public, bro. Because you're literally you're in public, but like yeah, there's but no you're, members of the public around. Yeah, I would never do it. It's like you it's like you lips and your girl right there. Mm-hmm. That's PDA, bro. That is PDA. Oh yeah, yeah, it's by definition it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you be comfortable doing that? In front of you, man? Yes. Well, like, real. Well, like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that's how it goes here. Yeah. Fair enough. I'll be looking at my phone. I don't, know, I don't care. <laughs> no, it's just normal, By the way, though. I'm saying peck, bro. I ain't saying yeah, no exactly. full grown no, lips no, in her, no, bro. Because no, no, no. yeah. I wouldn't do full lips in in public. I, <clears throat> like, nah, I'll do a, get me yeah. quick. Wait, would you not? Peck. What do you mean? But I not lips my girl here. Yeah. We'll give her a peck here. Yeah. I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> if she comes in, you're gonna turn her down. You ain't turning it down. Oh, if she came to me to give me a peck, I wouldn't turn it down. But as for oh, me, that's the only situation I do this. Exactly. Oh, like, I'm, not I'm, I'm not going <laughs> to. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not like that. Like, yeah, 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 I'm, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing but that. I have no issue with doing it in front of like if it's just you two here. Like that's cool with me. Again, Oxford Street. It, I don't go Oxford Street during the day in it. So if I go at night now. Pretty sure it's still busy now, but yeah. Yeah, even if it's busy, like I can't lie, I'll like she says, Oh yeah, give me a kiss. I'll run it still. To be honest, bare people do that in like central London. Like people are not afraid of PDA. No, I'm not I'm not afraid of it. It's just not in me to naturally do it. Yeah. So it has to be brought out of me. So that's why I would do it in certain situations. But like, for example, now I I don't think I would want to do it in like a house party. Like I would be a, I would like. Mm. Well, a quick peck in a house party, you wouldn't do that. What's no, the difference? That's, that's, that's not that deep. If it's not longer than yeah. That's not. The other thing you can, you can't fully lips your girl Unless anywhere you outside minute. your 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 privacy. places. Yeah, but any any privacy. Yeah, you can't do that. The people do that. I was though. gonna say we've seen that though. I've seen it. What with like in the public, bro? Yeah, like black people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that on the train. Fair, bro. fair enough. Me, fair me enough. personally, I on the ain't train, bro. I've seen that, bro. Hey, a lad, I seen that in cinema. That's yeah. Cinema is different, though. No, not if you're right next to me. Okay, that's wild. That still, 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 it's still. wild. They were right next to me. Still, still, just watch your film, bro. Like it's actually dark. No, you should be focusing on the screen. Yeah, exactly. the, I went watch them. Someone then like someone tapped me and be like, look over there, bro. Like, and they were right next they were same hour like a couple seats down so like it's noticeable isn't it but it's dark so I would have noticed if I wasn't tapped mm. so something like that would I do that I probably would lips in the cinema the yeah, cinema is it's different man it's, like, it's not private but it's not public it's it dark, is public it's, it's dark, dark, it's, dark. it's dark that's like, the main factor it's dark yeah so you, there is an element of privacy so you would lips there. in Oxford Street if it's dark I know no because that's, it's not dark no, but where in Oxford Street on the mains like outside the shop or like, yeah, like around the corner like, yeah it, it depends you wouldn't lips on the main streets of Oxford Street yeah, you, wouldn't you wouldn't do that you I wouldn't would. do that I've seen people do it but you wouldn't of your it. own accord like if she asked me yeah give me a kiss oh, yeah, kiss oh yeah that's not that deep but I wouldn't 
Like I don't like a full blown kiss. No, 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 no. no. It depends though. What do you mean it depains? You won't know <laughs> on the mains, day. Oxford Street mains. Yeah, bro. And you won't but know. If you're burst, if you're both burst, you've gone for drinks now. If you're both burst, can't lie to you. Sometimes it can go down, bro. Nah, bro. And when I say go down, I mean like you lot can just be passionate. You get me? That's what grown ups do. All it takes is a little hustle from what we say in podcast. Now, nah, fam, if you're recording, man, I'll. <laughs> People are nuts out here. But do you know what it is, though? Like, I ain't big, bro. So if you want to record me, it's not going to go on nowhere, bro. Do you get it? Like, I ain't big. So, mm. but in general, yeah, bro, I that. ain't big, bro. Like, it's possible, though, but it's just not likely, you know? One of them ones. Wow. And by the way, I would only do this if it's my girl. So if you're posting, man, thanks. You're posting me with That's my true. girl, bro. That's true. You're not going to just catch me lips in any babe, any on the street. Like, I mean, what if you didn't want um, people to know that you had a girl? What if I don't want people to know? It's like hiding your girl. It's not hiding your girl, but like you're not making it public. You're not making it a public thing. I would never make it public who my girl is. Yeah. But I, I have no issues with letting people know I have a girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. So if it then got shown that that's my girl, it's like, well, okay. I see because out now is what it is. I would. I don't think I'd be mad, but I'd just be like, whoever recorded me is a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah. But at the same time, it's my fault. Why am I doing it in public? Like that? Exactly. If I burst, like you said, <clears throat> I'll be real. When I'm burst, I'm. I still know what I'm doing. I hate that. I, I, I was burst. I didn't know what I was doing. I hate that. Oh, that's not a bath, bro. <laughs> that's not. It's a not bath. a bath, like man. You know what you're doing when you're burst, isn't it? You just are using this to, dis- bro. You just know. You just want to like. Cover up what you did mm. by saying, "Oh yeah, I was drunk." I'm like, no, you know what you're yeah, doing. You know what you're doing, man. So just to like, just to like avoid the guilt. Yeah, you know it's still there. Mm. Yeah, I mean, there is an element of it. Like, you have a lack of control. If that's the right phrasing to use, you're still in control, though. You're still in control, but like stuff that you is, if you were sober, you would have that thought, but you wouldn't do it. You'd kind of like restrict yourself. So you're just more confident. I guess, in a way. You're more impulsive. Imp- that's it. That's it. You're more impulsive yeah. when you're, yeah. Yeah. But the guilt doesn't me personally, go I don't, I don't, anywhere, bro. I ain't, I ain't letting no one bath me. Like, <laughs> you, whatever you do when you're drunk, you did it, bro. Yeah. Okay. Like, uh, Just firm your Drunk, thing. sober. You're getting the same. Like, it's just, there's no, oh, she was drunk. I allow it. Like, not nah, like, fam. Like. It's the same, it's like the same you, reaction, bro. Someone told me drunk thoughts, no, drunk actions is sober thoughts. Food for thought. Drunk acts. So Drunk thoughts, actions yeah. are sober thoughts. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Maybe not. You know. You know how hard that is, bro. Maybe it's maybe oh. it's not maybe it's not true. Maybe it's not true. Drunk actions are death or sober thoughts, bro. What if like you only thought that way because you're drunk? No, but that goes against the food for thought. Exactly. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm saying maybe it's wrong. So you don't. Oh my, my food for thought is wrong. Yeah, I'm saying maybe that is wrong. Hater. More a hater, but instead like. No, no. Me personally, that's how I think anyway. I Wait, think so. All the drunk thoughts you've had, or actions you've done while drunk, yeah, you didn't think about them when you're sober. <laughs> I don't know. Even Probably not. In the back of your mind. Probably not. Really. Not all. Not all of them. I don't know, man. It's actually There's not just, a single drunk action I've done. Yeah. That I didn't think of when I was sober. Fair enough. Everything I've done is because I wanted to do it. Maybe I haven't got that drunk yet then. <laughs> okay, man. Okay, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> come on, buddy. <laughs> no, but you know them ones where like people get so drunk they don't remember what they did. Yeah. I've never had that. I've exactly. never blacked yeah. out. Exactly. Like, I think that's the worst type of drunk. No, yeah, like, that's yeah. the the maximum capacity of. Have you man ever blacked drunk. out? That's no, mad. Blacked no, out. No, no, no. I mean, yeah, yeah. I've fallen asleep. I haven't blacked out. That, I don't think that counts. I think I almost died. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was a trigger one. Yeah, yeah, nah, it's, nah, like I told you about the story. <laughs> is that funny now? Like I tell you, I almost lost my yeah, life. I, I, I know, this, I know the story, but Dude, just came I'm out laughing because of the way he was like. It came out. Sorry. It came out so quick. Like I was, un- it was unexpected. I, I have told you. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I know the story. I know the story. I told you as well. What's wrong with you, bro? <laughs> What's the story? I was about fifteen, sixteen. Yeah. I need to, to set up. <sighs> I was about fifteen, sixteen. Year 11, it was my boy's birthday 
and everyone's gone to his crib. I was in boarding school, by the way. So everyone's left school. Everyone's gone to this crib after a match. It's Saturday night. Everyone's um, enjoying themselves. Never drank at this point, by the way. Never drank. <laughs> Never drank. No, I was pumped. Because naturally, I'm just like, yeah, me, yeah, I can do that. I can do that. Someone's giving me a full bottle of JD now. 40%. I don't know what that percentage means like back then. I'm like, yeah. it means nothing. Yeah. Sat down in the living room, everyone's snapping me. They know what it means. I don't know what it means. I don't know why they're snapping. I'm like, you know what? It's JD, man. I've necked half a bottle straight. No, like, no pauses, no stops. Stopped, got up now, walking around, walking around. I'm like, cool, cool. Like, slowly I st- it starts to get a little bit blurry. Like, my vision, like, I start to stumble a little bit. I'm like, eh, let me sit down, let me cool off. And I've gone upstairs now to lie down. I'm a bit tired. Now, oh. I'm lying on my back, facing the ceiling, and like, I start to doze off. Then I start to throw up. And I'm still on my back. So now like, if you're on your back and you're throwing up, it's not coming out. Like, you're basically drowning in your own, in your own vomit. So that's what was happening. But my boy was next to me, then he woke me up, then yeah, get me like. Have you not heard that story before? I have, but like, listening to it again is like, damn. I've heard other people say that's happened to them as well. Like, that's a common thing. Like, when you get too drunk and then, like, you fall asleep or whatever and you start yeah. throwing up, like... You start drowning in yeah, it. Yeah, like, you, you're not on your side or whatever. That would be the worst way to pass, oh, I think. 100. 100%. 100%. But I don't think... How, how could that even happen, though? Like, if you start feeling that choking sensation, what do you, would, yeah, yeah. you would turn and do that. Like, that's but, like, like, half a bottle of JD. Like, I, I couldn't really move, I'll be real. Fez, 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 Fez. I couldn't really move. So were you... I didn't know what was going Wait, on. Oh, you didn't know what was going on. No, oh, I say, yeah, yeah, done. Still. But you know, do you remember the day though? Oh, hundred. Like it was yesterday. <laughs> I'm ever forgetting that day, I'll be real. Oh, no, but like, do you remember like everything else that happened on that day? Or like, did you black out? Like you don't know what happened? Cause I don't remember like, probably like the immediate 10 seconds after my boy woke me up, that's gone. After that, I remember everything. Yeah, I've never. Cause I know blackout in terms of I've been knocked out. Like when I fell off my back, I got knocked out. That's scary. In fact, I didn't get knocked. That's the thing that I didn't get knocked out, but I don't know what happened. Then you probably did pass out. But I didn't because I ran to the house. Apparently, this is when I was very young. I ran to the house. I like I was crying in it, and then like <laughs> I think you told this story before. Yeah, like I, I got like I got knocked. Off, like, I didn't get knocked off. I got pushed off my back. Pushed. Long story. <laughs> got pushed on my back, and now. All that is in my memory till today is I woke up in the hospital and I asked my mom what happened. I looked down at my shirt, I see blood on my Chelsea top. I'm thinking, what the hell is going on? Yeah, maybe you were in shock. When I was, when I, in, when, in that moment. In, yeah, after you fell over. Oh, I, was, I probably was, because I, I don't know what's going on. Like, I actually looked down, I'm thinking, what's going on? Like, I'm not in pain, I don't feel nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, I sleep yeah. again, I wake up, I'm in, I'm on the hospital bed and um. Yeah, then you definitely passed out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> might have got knocked out. Actually, no, not, but not you said you said you ran you home because yeah, yeah, I ran yeah. home. So that and then you went what to your room? Or I don't I know. I think th- what happened. They, this is what they told me. So they were like, "Oh yeah, you um you ran home, blah blah blah." Then probably just took me to the hospital, didn't it? Yeah. Also, the, the, the actual story didn't get told to me. Like oh, they, yeah. they didn't paint me a picture of what happened, but that's all I know but all I know like I don't even remember I, I never knew I got pushed off I don't know anything I don't ever I don't remember anything that happened before that that if I got knocked off yeah. so that's what my idea of blacking out is because that is so that is similar to what happened li- if you I feel like that's literally what blacking out is like you don't remember last night oh yeah don't I don't remember I've, I've been knocked out I think I know, I know I know what it feels like but I don't know like how it actually played out you know what I'm saying that's weird like Everyone's telling you where you were, but you don't remember that. I've never, I've never been knocked out or passed out or anything like that. I think it's dangerous to even get that drunk. One hundred percent. Because if someone tells you you did something, you can't even tell them you didn't. Yeah, confidently. Yeah, you no one. Know. Yeah, that's the thing. Someone tried to run that on me one time as a joke. That oh yeah, I must have done something. I said, bro, no, I didn't, bro. Don't try that. <laughs> No I, funny, not, <laughs> no, I, no, I didn't, bro. <laughs> They're like, yeah, you did, but you got bad drunk. I was like, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Don't try it. Man knows how. I'm like, I'm a patterned person when I'm, you get me burst. Yeah. Like, you can tell me what's, you can give, like, you can ask me questions. I'll answer you properly. Mm. But inside, I am burst. I'm finished. 
So it's like, to me, the, the, what I feel like a toxic trait of man is that I will think, I think people should always act the way I act. In terms of, okay. If I'm drunk, bro, be, you're still patterned, bro. Like, I'm not, I'm not, all, I'm not all over the place. I'm not falling down. I can be bare happy. I can be bare giddy and all that, but I'm not going to be a nuisance. Yeah, but I feel like some people have different tolerances for alcohol. Yeah, you but should, that's not know your limit. But that's bro. not a tolerance. Is that a tolerance? That's just natural. If you're not, if you don't act like they do, <clears throat> you're obviously more tolerant to it yeah. than they are. And with you saying know your limit, I don't think you know your limit until you've you passed reach, your yeah. limit. Yeah. Until you've yeah, passed your limit, time, you don't know your time. limit. Yeah, you reach yeah, it one time, then from then true, you should know. True, yeah, true, I don't true. think so. What? No, true, it's true. Of course you true, should, bro. It's true. It's true. How like, can you not know? After I feel one like time? you stop drinking or consuming either when you know that you don't want to get burst today, like a cool in it. You take one yeah. or two and that's it. Or you stop when you've reached the limit of oh, I'm burst. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. That means it's too late. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's it's too late, but it's still within control. Or it hasn't kicked in yet. No, no, no. Like, let's say you've taken a couple of sips, 30 minutes later, you're, you're feeling like you're about to get burst. You wouldn't now take another sip. You've probably already passed your threshold by a bit, but it's still within control, isn't it? Like, I've, never, still be I've, I've never reached that point of, oh, I'm about to get <clears> burst. <throat> like, I if you just, take any more, it's, you, it's going to get long. No, hey, I think everyone's have, been there. I've never everyone's reached that. I've never reached that. Oh. <laughs> your birthday. I never reached the point of, ah, oh, no, I'm going to get burst. I'm burst now. Not bro. your most recent birthday. Birthday before that. Yeah, but if, with, yeah. exactly, with that, you were probably drinking to get burst. No. Like, I just, I was just drinking. Yeah, but you had no, you were, you, you didn't look like you knew what you were. <laughs> <Yeah>. That's <laughs> a lie. You were just what? drinking. You were bro, just I had, drinking. I, rec- I, can, I can recall everything that happened that day, bro. From the start to finish. Fez. And I've already told you, man, what happened that day. So why, why you man keep trying to say, oh yeah, I got knocked out. I like you so much. Oh, you did get knocked out, yeah. On the bed? Yeah. yeah man. Bro, okay, I yeah. fell asleep, yeah, you bro. you fell asleep. That's, you, that's the same thing that's happened to me before. You I literally, asleep, I yeah. fell asleep, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, well, I, like, bro, <clears throat> honestly, genuinely, yeah. I've already said what, it was something else, innit? That's what I'm going to say. It was something else. What? What? We can't get into it, <laughs> but it was something else, innit? <laughs> But in general, that day, I'll be real. Oh, yeah. I was not burst. Of that bottle? I promised to God. I didn't even finish it, bro. Neither did I. I was not burst, bro. You were burst. Let's get oh, that no, out of the I'm way. I'm not saying I was. Okay, bro. cool, cool. I'm yeah, not saying I'm saying you didn't finish. You know, though, I know exactly what happened. Apparently you were burst, but I was sleeping at this point where everything was going down. People mm. were cleaning the house. People were, get me. I was. I think after what well, I've just told you about the story, after that, I think that day was probably the most burst I've been. No, the most burst I've been... Nah, there's more for days in it. What's the most burst I've been? I don't know. Because when people can tell you're drunk, that's when you know you're gone. Because right. normally for me, no one can really tell that I'm I'm gone. But when someone's saying, oh yeah, he's gone, that's when you know you're gone. You know what I'm saying? Like You think you're sober, but people tell me, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, normally it's the eyes. The sad eyes, isn't it? I, I, I ain't never got sad eyes, but I've got people coming to me like, are you okay? How would you know you haven't got sad eyes though? If people are sad eyes, I mean, mm. They probably are like, you. and you're drunk. You won't really be. I don't like, think I've been sad eyes because yeah. I actually don't act like a nuisance. There's like genuinely, I can come in and sit. No, I would just be mad giddy in it. So if you're sad on me because I'm giddy, you can cool in it. But I'm not the ah, let's shout ah. ah. No, I'm not that. I don't think many people are the around. No, no I've people. seen. <clears throat> I've seen you. I'm not a shout. I don't shout, bro. First year. First year on the oh, street. Oh, that's so different. First that was on black, bro. That, that was literally oh, after no. a motive. That no was literally way. after oh, a motive to show oh, you. Oh, my oh, gosh. My and that is one time four you know exactly years ago. About. Huh? You know, you know what you're yeah. talking about? Bro, you know, you know what he's talking about. <laughs> you do, when you four years that. ago, man. What day was it? What year was first year? I don't year? know. It was like after a motive, we're walking up to... Where, what was that shopping center called? High Cross. High Cross, you know. Walking up to High Cross and I was just shouting. You were just shouting bad, innit? Yeah, but that's not how I am when I'm drunk. Okay. Where is it? How are you how are you when you're drunk? Do you know what it is? I'm just I don't know. You swear a lot. Swear? <laughs> probably. Probably. Swear a lot. Probably. <laughs> Cause I've been trying Does to he? not swear. So when I'm drunk, I probably do swear a lot, innit? <laughs> Man is trying to play with it on <laughs> Oh, oh, come on, they are. <laughs> yeah. On the mains. I'm not saying on the mains. This on was the... at like 3 a.m. Who cares? What time was it? 
Uh, yeah, three fifteen. Yeah, late man. Yeah, wait. What are you like when you're? That's that's probably the most out of character I've seen him. But I like while drunk. That wasn't because of me being drunk though. Like, well, what was it because of? <sighs> I, just... I chose to shout there. Yeah, I chose to shout there. It wasn't involuntary. <laughs> It was involuntary, then you have a problem, innit? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Um, but yeah, uh, people do are like that. Like people are just messy and shout a lot. And all yeah, and place. that's the thing. They are like, that's just- I can't handle that. I can't do that. Like I, I get, like, you know when you're in a motive now, yeah? And you know like, nah, today I'm not really trying to get drunk. I'm not really trying to drink. And you're witnessing people that are at that level. It's like, it's mad annoying. Like I was watching a podcast now. They're talking about, oh yeah. They must. They're Americans, in it, so they're on different. They're on different stuff, in it. So, um, they're talking about. Oh yeah, he has friends that um sniff, and he's like, oh yeah, if all his friends are sniffing, then he knows he's leaving in an hour. Cause like, I'm not trying to get on that level, and it's like you're gonna be annoying me because I'm not yes, on that level. Do you yeah. get? Do you get? Yeah. So that's that's low key how I am when people are acting like. You get me? Cause one, I don't want to make it seem like. I'm judging them because I'm not like, you get me, you're, you're on your level, but it's like, you know them people that are drunk and they start, ah, you, oh, bro, you're, you're, you're hitting me, bro, you know? Annoying. You're hitting me, you it's know? Annoying. That's what's getting, like, you're hitting me, like, it's cool, innit? Like, the first two times it's calm, then you keep doing it. Like, um, <laughs> the game's like, what was that? At our friend's crib. I wasn't there, was I? Yes, you were. Yes, you were. Yes, you were. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. One person just about. kept, and shouting and shouting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do I do? Why do? I, why is my memory so bad? <laughs> Type it on the thing. You'll remember instantly. Uh, uh, well, uh, when when was this? Uh, what year? Age? It's like three, four like, months ago. Yeah. Well, and he was there. Yeah. Everyone was not everyone, but that. And he was there. He was there, bro. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I didn't think I was there, but I said I went to games that, and he was there. It's not far from from your crib, bro. I picked you up. Oh yeah, he was <laughs> pissing me off. Oh, he was pissing me <laughs> off, man. He was pissing me off. Nah. He was pissing me off, man. That, oh, everyone, like, everyone could really deep it. Was like, bro, just get me. Like, it's not funny anymore. Like, just cool down. <laughs> but is that? That's what I'm saying. I'm not like that when I get birth. I'm not like that. I'm just giddy, and it's like it's giddy to a point where it's a good vibe still. I'm, 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 I'm the vibes uh, when I'm burst. I think it depends on what you drink, up real. You think? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, different alcohol has yeah, different yeah, effect. One hundred percent. Come on, bro. If you drink anything that is clear of color, you are getting burst. <laughs> <laughs> if you drink anything tequila, yeah, uh, that vodka, Jeez. everything, you're getting burst. Yeah, nephews. Hennessy, yeah, you can drink that, get burst, but you're you're calm. Oh, that's a fact. You're calm. Any any dark liquor, it keeps you calm, but you're still enjoying it. Depends how much you drink. Well, you drink half a bowl of Jack Daniels yeah, that, by that, itself. Bro. I don't know who does that, but even even I've never actually had Jack Daniels like that. Let me really. think about times of what mm. is Jack Daniels? Is it whiskey? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's probably the same thing. But you... So Ciroc. Yeah, same thing. Oh, damn. Where's, where's Ciroc's, Ciroc's dangerous. Yeah. Ciroc's dangerous. Vodka. Yeah, it's vodka. It's yeah, dangerous because it tastes like juice sometimes. Nope. Oh, uh, sometimes nope. it does, bro. <laughs> sometimes it does, bro. Vodka doesn't the taste like juice. The apple one. The you, apple one. The apple bro. one is dangerous. We just keep. They all taste disgusting. Like none no, of them no. taste oh, like. Bro. The one at my event. The one at my event. Done me still. None of them taste like their flavors. Just keep, yeah, yeah, and then you're like, whoa. I'm even trying to find. Why you can't walk two meters? Like. Exactly. I had one bottle. Was it? Was it the AU? Was it AU? No, AU is shit, man. AU didn't dumb me still. That was, my, this, that was my birthday was this year. Recent, yeah, 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 yeah. What's the blue favor of Ciroc? Is it that's the, that's the original one. Blue the cap. Blue, blue cap. Yeah. Blue cap. Isn't that the original one? Isn't that the grape one? No. What's the original color then? There's one that's just classic vodka. Bro, I'm telling know. you. I don't know. Let me type in right now. I know I'm not I was thinking. acting a fool in this event. The man. Apple one. Yeah. Yes, so the, the original one is blue. Yeah. That one? Done my dance though. The done me basically. dirty. Yeah, Sorok is sweet. I've only, I think I've only had Sorok maybe twice, clear. twice in my life. No, the mix I had <clears> one time at a wedding, when I went to a wedding this year, uh, it was a red Sorok. That's the cherry or Cherry or whatever. Never had it. With cherry coat. Oh my God. I said, anytime I go out now, that's my mix. 
Like if I'm in a if I'm in a place where it does that, that's my mix straight. Cause I'm drinking that. That's oof, that's going down. That's mm. sweet, and I'm not getting burst. Maybe because I'm not drinking in heavy amounts. But I was going back to that. Well, I was thinking, yo, oh, this is sweet. They're like, this is. Yeah. Do you get it? That's like what vodka coke. That's what most people get. Vodka There's coke. one. It's not that sweet. I, I don't like Jack Daniels. This run of sweet. This run of sweet still. It's yeah. not that strong though. What twenty eight percent? I don't like it. Oh, is it twenty eight percent? This run is not my drink to go and Never say. Yeah, it. let me go and get burst That's today. Then no. wine. Wine, wine's a different story. Yeah, wine's actually a different story. I can't even lie. Like, I, I don't think I drink wine unless I'm yeah doing yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't act, bro. I hate when he does this, fam. You're on the wave. You know exactly what he meant. What the fuck, he's talking about this dumbass man. You know exactly what he meant. What mean, the fuck are you talking about? If you don't know, then man, it's I like, drink wine to cool myself <clears> down, bro. Relax myself after a week by yourself. I've done that before. Yeah? Can't lie. I've done that before. By yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Quarantine? <laughs> what? Oh, I remember one snap. Wait, you went, it was even you went to the shop or you went to the shop? It was me, bro. Yeah, it was you. Yeah, 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 yeah it was yeah. him, yeah. I went to the shop, put myself in <laughs> a nice Echo Fools. By yourself. Yeah. Thank you. Cool myself down, bro. It relaxes me. Echo I don't know what it does to you, though. one? In in the the Barefoot. That's it. Have you drank that? Yeah, that's that. That one is something else. That's, that's the different. Brand, I swear. Huh? That's the brand. Oh, Pink Mascara. Oh, yeah, Barefoot is the brand. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, then I'm dumb. <laughs> I thought it was something else. <laughs> I thought it was something else. It's Barefoot, yeah. That, with wine, it's like the percentage would be like 23%. Or is it even twenty three? I think it's even less than that, you know, or something like that. Like yeah, yeah, probably yeah, less. Listen, wine hits different, and then bro. You can still get burst on my like, life. It doesn't make sense it on my life. Sense. Doesn't it's a different sense. kind of burst though. It's a more like a relaxed, uh, you feel yeah, energized, but not energized. How the hell are you feeling energized? If you know what you're drinking for, you know what you're drinking for, man. What's wrong with this cat? <laughs> 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 oh. I ain't got a clue what you lot are talking about, innit? <clears throat> but wine, man. Wine is a good one still. Have you man got, um, go on. I'm going to hop off the spirits very soon in my life. Don't drink any spirits anymore, man. Spirits is just alcohol, bro. I swear. No, spirits, spirits is, is like vodka. It's the clear stuff. The white stuff, yeah. yeah. Oh, there's a difference. Tequila, yeah. That's dark liquor yeah. and there's spirits. I bro, tequila's the worst thing. I hate it. Bro. What's the, what'd you point out your head drink for? <laughs> I didn't quite anything, bro. What are you doing, bro, man? <laughs> Just, what the hell? Don't try it. It's the way Abu just makes me feel. It makes me feel like I'm on <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> a vibe. <laughs> I ain't drunk like his man. <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 Nah, yeah, nah, nah. Bro. Tequila, I hate it still. Like, don't drink it. It tastes rubbish. Nah, I don't drink it still. That's nah. the only shot I'll do. I'll do tequila shots in a club with that lemon slice. Nah, I hate nah, it still. Nah, 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 nah. I hate Why? it. Nah, I did it at um, Odell's event. That's the last time I'm doing it. Why? It doesn't, doesn't do anything. It don't do nothing. Yeah, that, It doesn't do anything, yeah. bro. Nah, tequila shots don't do like, nothing. Unless you're doing like five minimum. Like, you're not really feeling anything. There's no point. You might as well get a quick... Ray Red Bull, double up. I'm never drinking Ray and Nephews again. That is disgusting. Mm. With Red Bull though. Irrelevant, irrelevant, irrelevant. Keep it 100. I'm not buying Red Bull and Ray's no more. From when they charged me 16 yeah, pounds, that, that bro, said allow it, fam. Lie. Man would rather get shots, bro. Ray and Red Bull does not taste this, nice. This, man's getting a double Ray and Red Bull. Bro, I finish it. Bro, I'm trying to go back to the bar to buy something else because it's done nothing to me. Waste. If I spend 16 pounds on shots now, I'm feeling it, bro. 100% I'm feeling something. Mm. Why am I doing that? It's a waste of money. What goes through you lot's head like when you're, when you're getting to that stage, but you're not at that stage yet? Of what, drinking? That's what I'm saying. When you lot are saying that you, you get to a level like, okay, I'm about to go. I don't get that. I swear. Well, I don't you don't get think that. like that. You don't feel not that, that I think, I don't think like that. I don't, like, I don't get to that stage. I'm either sober or gone. I'm either sober or, no, 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 not, yeah, yeah. I'm either sober. Oh, I'm, I've, oh, I'm waved. I'm burst, bro. Yeah, because you can get to that stage where like you feel good, and then there's another stage where you're, like you're feeling like really good. And if you know if you drink any more, it's gonna start feeling less. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna start having less control of this feeling mm. and start, you know, yeah, literally. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hundred percent, hundred percent. I can feel burst, but with me, I can like I can keep going because like I'm cool. Yeah. Or oh, I feel I'm cool. I don't know I'm cool until the end of the motive. 
Yeah. Yeah. Because I realise now. Anytime I've left the motive now, it's the end. When I'm walking now, I'm thinking, okay, this is too much now. It's calm. It's too much. It's too much. <laughs> then I have to be like, okay, cool. Let me get some water. Because them times where it's too much now, it's like, all right, yeah, cool. It's not fun anymore, man. It's calm. It's not fun. Uh, yeah. Yeah. When what? You're two bursts? Yeah, I'm two bursts. It's not fun, bro. Like, you- anything that's too much is not fun. Yeah. Let me make that clear. It's not fun, bro. Like, you're not it's enjoying true. yourself anymore. It's true. Yeah, when you get to that point, yeah. When I, you I get to that point, it's like, it's not fun, bro. Like, and bro. I feel like the levels of, of drunk you go to depends on the crowd. Like true. If, if it's just a man them vibing, I don't really care. I'll be real. But if there's now, there's now girls there, it's like, bro, don't act. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Now, I feel like if there's if people- there's girls you around, you have to control yourself more. Yeah, if there's people you're not normally around. You get best around the man them like that. Man, don't really chill together like that for me to do that though. When you deep it, that's what I'm saying. But like, if I'm you, saying that like, hypothetically, yeah. Oh, I would get drunk, but if there's now <clears throat> unfamiliar faces, it's like, mm, now I start vomiting in front of you. Know you wouldn't vomit though, yeah, because you control yourself. That's my point. I've never in my life vomited in front of someone. I have, <laughs> you have, yeah, your birthday, yeah, that same day. What do you mean in front of though, huh? What do you mean in front of like she was right there? Like she's seen you thrown up. Yes, bro. Even you, you, exactly. I you thought you said that you went to the toilet, mm. and she was right there, bro. She's in the toilet. Yes. What's up? What's up, baddie? Is this? <laughs> Why is she in the toilet? What was he from? No, I went there by myself, and I think she heard me. Just came to help me in it. Oh, yeah. You're not a baddie, my man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even not. Yeah. I'm yeah, thinking, yeah. why are you in the toilet whilst I'm throwing up? What are you doing? No, I was there by myself, and then she just came to help me. Oh, okay, that's a good person. That's a good person. You're, no. you know who it is. I have a feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the only time I've ever... I've never in my life thrown up in front of someone. Yeah, that, that they taught me to just... Yeah, be around unfamiliar faces, just take it easy. Uh, you can't risk doing a matting, you know what I'm saying? 100%. Mm, do you know what it's like? Let's say now we go to a club for you. Let's say your birthday now. We go to Manchester. Mm-hmm. I ain't gonna look to... Because it's, I'm looking to just enjoy myself and after if I can pattern, I'll pattern, innit? But I can't believe I just said that on the board. <laughs> I was, you know what? I was just, just carry on in it. I was going to say, there's no need. <laughs> you said it quietly though. No, no, no. They definitely heard that. But <laughs> I didn't even hear what you said. Exactly. No, they definitely heard that. The mic is right here, bro. Yeah, true. Do you know what <laughs> Let's be honest. I'm a, I'm a young man, innit? <laughs> nah. Anyways. <laughs> Hey, when I say pattern, I mean like speak to girls and see if I like them or not. You get me? Have a vibe. But now, that's my main focus. I'm just trying. To, why are you laughing? I'm smiling, bro. I'm trying to just in, like I'm trying to enjoy myself, bro. I'm trying to because there's a pretty girl there. I'm now trying to limit myself so I can look good in front of her. Like Aww. she be able to understand that it's a motive, bro. Like I'm trying to get burst, from, not burst. I'm trying to enjoy myself for you get me my boy's bread, my brother's birthday. Then again, I'm not, I never drink to become like that. Oh yeah, I'm burst. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, I don't do that. I actually don't do that. Like, I just drink to, you get me? Yeah, it's not, a, good. it's not a, oh, let me, let me, let me bulk up with the yak so I can get more confidence. Yeah, like, no, it's allow like, that, man. Like, that one there is a bit, like. That's a bit, I don't know. Why, why are you relying on, on the yak to now do certain things do you get, do? Do you get, that ain't me, still. You yak. It's true. It's like it's giving you a false personality. And that just goes all the way down to like different parts. Do you mind have like guilty pleasures? I don't know what that means. Guilty pleasures means like something you find pleasure in, but like if you were to talk to other people about it, you might feel a bit guilty about it. So what are you talking about? Like what? Like dipping your biscuits <laughs> in water or something? <laughs> That's a weird example. But like, let's say- oh, no. The reason why he said that- No, because people do that. <laughs> Wait, why did he say- I don't, but I don't know why. He, I don't know what he's saying. Soggy biscuits. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Why did you I, bro, I just said that's. I, I thought that's what a guilty pleasure is. Like you enjoy it, but no, you know some that's people. Not, that's not extreme enough. It can be, but that is a guilty pleasure, though. <sighs> like, would you be embarrassed to say that? Yes. You, and you biscuits dip and your water? biscuits in water. Not, I was that embarrassed. That's not that what? deep. Bro. That's, 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 that's something you get to do. I wouldn't do it, but it's not that deep. So you've done it before. 
No. So you've done it before? No. So you'd be embarrassed to do it because it's not a normal thing? No, because I, I, I don't really get No, I like, would do it like Because people normally dip their biscuits in tea. Yeah. yeah or milk. But it gives the same, same soggy yeah. effect, bro. Pause. Yeah, but you wouldn't. Like, if you're drinking a cold glass of water, you're going to dip your biscuits in Don't get water. twisted. I wouldn't do that because I don't like, like, that's just not me. I've never yeah. done it. But if it's something that I like to do, I'm going to say, oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, no. It, give me examples of your guilty pleasures. You start off, bro, because I ain't got no, I don't think I got I need any. to know what you guys are talking about. Guilty <laughs> pleasures. A guilty pleasure is something like, I like when, oh, no, that's mad explicit still. Oh, he's talking about, in that situation, what situation? Like those are just examples of that situation. Yeah, there's others. There's others though. Like that's probably like the, the easiest example. Easiest to example. Say. Yeah. Is it, are we talking about like fetishes? Oof. That's probably a fork of guilty pleasures. Yeah. Okay, you guys list yours, and then I'll know what we're talking about. Like someone can say a guilty pleasure is them being insulted. Wait. Okay. You get it? That's what I'm saying. A guilty pleasure is like something, oh, something okay, low okay, key yeah, weird. Yeah, yeah. I mean. I Do you get it? Like yeah, something yeah. weird. Like, yeah, it's not, you, yeah, it's not yeah. a normal thing. Yeah. Biscuits and water is not a normal thing, but never mind. Biscuits and water is like, it's just like. It's not a I wouldn't be embarrassed thing. to say if I. Yeah, I wouldn't be embarrassed to say if that. If I actually liked it, I'd be like, yeah, bro, try it. A guilty pleasure, though. Like, I wouldn't call it a guilty pleasure. It's like, for example, when I was young, I like in the meat with ketchup. Yeah, there, that's a guilty pleasure, man. No, <laughs> I'm not fucking guilty. What are you talking pleasure. about, bro? I ain't getting pleasured by this shit. Like, <laughs> no, no, you don't have to be pleasured up. by it. said ketchup. Is that nice? No, I had a, no, back then I had like a ketchup, like, man had to eat ketchup, everything with ketchup. Oh, like and a ketchup. Like, f- yeah, I had a ke- phase. ketchup phase, yeah. Yeah, that's not nice. Guilty pleasure. I, don't, I ain't got none that I can think of. But that would actually count as one, though. Like, it doesn't have to. Indian pleasure. ketchup. Yeah, that, that would be a guilty pleasure. Cause it's weird, but you like it, so it pleasures you. I think one of mine is listening to bare old school Disney songs. I do that as well sometimes. No, I mean like high school musical. I do that as well sometimes. Okay, then that's one of yours then. <laughs> yeah, I guess I didn't think that was a. How was that? I mean, like people do that. I'm trying to think of like a. <clears throat> yeah, 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 I can see I why know, people I'm think not really that was. to say it, but I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Let me search what. It... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's something you find pleasure in, but you feel guilty and. Expressing mm, it to other people, kind mm, of thing. Mm, mm. I don't know. Um, it's tough. I mean, to be fair, people are saying stuff like sleeping in late, watching your favorite children's movie as an adult. What? Ordering food for delivery. Ordering food for delivery. That's exactly what it says, word for word. What does it say there? Ordering food that's for delivery. Exactly, that's exactly what it says. Um. <clears throat> Guilty pleasure. Or like eating cereal with water. That's not, f- that's weird. Exactly, that would be a guilty pleasure. If that, you said you that enjoy that. <laughs> that. That's extreme. I don't know. Uh, guilty pleasure, guilty pleasure. I mean, if we, if we want to go to the other side, you know, for our PG listeners, isn't it? Um, yeah, you guys go ahead. <laughs> brother, I'm reading it off the internet, bro. <laughs> oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> Let me have a look. Oh, this is weird, man. I can't even read this out loud. Um, okay, um. That would be one. That would be one of mine. What is it? I think. How is that a guilty pleasure? Oh, because you're meant to be working, exactly, but you're exactly. Did it then? That it's not. Yeah, I mean, if you. Yeah, it's weird because if you say it to your boy, you wouldn't feel embarrassed. Yeah, I think it. what we're doing is mixing fetishes and guilt. Yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe. yeah, yeah. Because that sounds, yeah, that sounds more like. Because even then, yeah, I, I guess that's a guilty pleasure. Then, yeah. I'm trying to find some. Maybe man them that man them that say they like toes, but that's probably a fetish. That's a fetish. I think that's a fetish. Yeah, I feel like if you do something with those toes, that's a guilty pleasure. Yep, I'm right. I'm definitely right. Okay. <laughs> so if a girl slap my f- no no let me yeah, 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 say, yeah, yeah, yeah. if no, you enjoy a girl slapping you with her feet that's, that's a, a guilty example. pleasure that's mad oh wait with her feet or that's even f- slapping you in general that's a guilty pleasure okay yeah true no I was saying feet though cause yeah, of, yeah cause well if you enjoy getting um abused in while you're doing it then that's a guilty pleasure isn't that BDSM I don't know what that is <laughs> <laughs> no man the one man. Man of a man. <laughs> I don't even know what it stands for either. 
I'm on the fuck. Funny in the zone, I said, show man, I'm funny in the zone, I'm something. I swear, is it even BDSM, bro? I don't really know, nigga. I swear, like, there's another letter. I only know the first one. I don't know what the. That's the that's <sighs> I'm in private browser, that's why. Bondage, discipline, or domination. No, no, don't know how to say that word. Masochism. So I don't even know what that is. Um, a lot of you, know, it's, you never know what people are into, like when it comes to the bedroom, you know. Literally, I know. but I feel like that's something that people take to the grave. If you're in, if you're if you're interested in something that you know it's a real guilty pleasure, you don't want to say it. Like it's only going to be between you and the female you're doing it with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's not to the grave then. If someone else knows about it. But that's, yeah, no, but that's fair, definitely fair. to the grave. It's to the grave. Between you, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But well, if you break up, it's long days. <coughs> no, long, you would long hope days. That I, I don't think she, so, yeah, hope. she was part of it. Like, it was joint enterprise. She may say, like, let's say, like, you know, gal can, you know, gal like she to, can twist it. No, 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 no. gal like to be self, um, what's the word that we like to use sometimes? Where girls are out in guys, but they're out in themselves as well. Suicide bomber. Suicide bomber. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they can do that on you, you know? But I don't feel yeah. it's like, let's say a girl asks another girl, oh, like, what's the weirdest thing you've done in the bedroom? Boom. And then she'll say something that you liked that was very, quite weird. But yeah, she, she is out on herself. Yeah. She named she, I don't think she would. I don't think she would name drop. There would be no reason to. Unless, she unless you're trying to shame Yeah, but it would yeah. be bait. It would be bait anyways, if they've What's, been in a relationship. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay. If she says they're in a relationship, she doesn't have to give that deal. It could be of any... Yeah, really but like even then now, for example, now I'm just gonna use this people because these are the three people, first people that came to mind. Diara and Ken, they broke up. They're a YouTube mm-hmm. couple. If you know them, you know them. Mm-hmm. If Diara went to now do an interview one day and they asked, "What's the weirdest thing you've done?" and she comes and says, "Oh yeah, man, done a mad thing with someone." Yeah, everyone's gonna assume it's Ken. Yeah, but they might not be right. Yeah, but it's still gonna throw it back on him because like that was the relationship. That's isn't it? Perception, bro. That's everyone's perception. All he has to say is it wasn't me. You wouldn't, yeah, even he huh? you wouldn't even say that. Though. Exactly. I don't think it would even, if it wasn't him, I don't think he'd even own up to it. I even saw something today about all that perception stuff now, yeah. And they asked a question. It's a mad question. It's been asked bare times before, innit? I'm not trying to stay on it for too long because it's mad weird, innit? But you don't even have to answer. But um, <laughs> ask the question, bro. Would you rather. No, no. I lie if I'm. Man's not even trying to do this, bro. Because it's mad weird. Let's answer the, let's it's about answer a goat and it's about. Chill, man. Uh, Good. We're good, yeah? Yeah. Sure. Yeah, it's recording now, yeah. You know, I clocked. We didn't even do intro. We actually just flew in. Wait, are you, it's recording, yeah? Yeah, it's recording. It went black. I don't know why. How long before, though? Just, no, literally for a sec. I clocked it straight away. Oh, cool. <clears throat> Go on. What were we talking about? Intro, bro. Now we'll get back into it. Yeah, you said we didn't do an intro. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Still what we saying? Intro po- halfway <laughs> into the thing, though. All right. <laughs> I was I actually just left in it, but you know, I'll do it. But yeah, it's the what we say in podcast show. Is that how I say it? What we say in show. Oh yeah, it's the what we say in show. It's your boy Hustler or Hustle. I'm joining my co-host, T9 Million in the building. What are you saying? I'm also joining my other co-host, the man behind the scenes, the man behind the camera. He has no face, but he has a name. His name is Benzo Ape. Yo. But yeah, what are we saying? Um, uh, we're talking about. Um, That's yeah, what I'm saying. I can't remember what we're talking about. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But what was girls, I saying? Girls doing it to guys, as in girls ruining a friendship with us. I lie. You said that, or one of you said that. <sighs> no, I just said if a girl ever tried to do it with me, I would tell her to say my Oh, yeah, say mom's mom's oh, yeah I was saying like, yeah, people lie on their mums and all that. Yeah. Personally, any girl that tries to run that with me, I just wouldn't believe it. You got to show me in real life, innit? That. You know them situations where like you're gonna have to like you're gonna have to prove this innit? So you're gonna have to do the mad thing right now, like like if you tried it with me in real life, I can't lie to you. You're gonna have to like do a mad thing to prove it, innit? Like you're gonna have to lips me or something. I'll be able to tell off of energy, body language, hundred percent. You'll be able to tell. No, no, prove it. You think? Yeah, that's what we'll prove it. I don't. I believe actions, bro. No, I don't believe no words. <laughs> prove it. If you like me so much, kiss me right now. I'm telling you, if you ain't yeah. gonna kiss me, you're lying. Shift. I ain't got time for the games. It's gotta depend if she's attractive or not to you. Oh, come on, buddy. <laughs> come on, buddy. <laughs> come on, buddy. 
Come on, buddy. Uh, some man, some man are. I don't even know what the word is, but like, regardless of what their friend looks like, if their friend puts it on them, screen light. I know, I know a lot of dogs. I know a lot <laughs> of dogs. dogs. dogs I yeah. know a lot of dogs. A lot of dogs. Like, when they get a burst, there's no standards left. There's no standards. Like, you're looking at them, bro. You know this is mad. <sighs> and each to their own. Every girl is beautiful in their own way. But, in terms of standards, a lot of people have standards of, you know what your, like what you would take or what you do, what you move to. Yeah. If I know you're moving ten times below below your standard, brother, yeah, 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 what yeah, were yeah, you yeah, drinking, yeah, bro? Yeah, Did yeah, someone true. spike you? Like, hmm. <laughs> even get, getting spiked on that out, that's my worst fear. Yeah, that's why I don't put my drink down. And like, I've they have never. Those, put- they have those things now, these covers that you can take. That like um, I've only seen that in a few clubs. Yeah, they have like a cover and then it has a small hole for a straw and that's it. And then no one can, can spike your drink. But that's actually crazy that people do that, you know. Yeah, I heard some like, but it's obviously it's mainly mainly men, though, isn't it? Mostly men, I get spiked. No, that's, the story that, you said that's, last week. That's that that was that. I think that's an anomaly. I can't lie. I've never heard something like that before. I'll be right. I have Not no like clue that. what story you're talking about. The story where the, the two murders, girls, bro. two girls spiked. Oh, drink, yeah. yeah. I was thinking, what did I say? Yeah, but most most time it's men spiking, women's drinking clubs. No, how brutal. Listen to podcasts back in the day. A lot of guys have been spiked. A lot of guys. That, but obviously it wasn't the girl spiking them, was it? I don't so know like, if it was a girl that spiked them though. I just know they oh, got right. spiked. Oh right, 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 right. Mm, man, them spiking, man, them. <clears throat> I don't know. It could be a girl. It could be a guy. I don't know, but some people oh. see it as funny. I don't even know where you get that. I don't the... see that as like, remotely funny in any department. There's two things I don't play with. Don't put stuff in my food. Don't play with my food either. I don't like, like, you know, when people like they will do spit in their finger, put in their food. Don't do that with me. Don't spit in my food. Don't do that. That's the one thing I don't play with my food and my drinks. Don't do that because it goes inside of me. I don't like that. Don't play with me. <laughs> but I can take a joke. But that's not a joke. Right. What's funny about this? It's manners, man. <laughs> Respect. Man. Literally. Spitting on someone's food. Where did you grow up, bro? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not funny. <laughs> no, that's like, not funny. What 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 did you see that made you think, yeah, this is all right, this is normal? Like, what the hell? Manners, man. No one's got you know what I've seen? No one has manners these days, bro. You think? How what's it called? Home training. No one's got home training. Not even that. On the roads, bro. You're driving. Give someone way. They don't flash. No thank you. Oh, I swear to you, that can ruin my day, man. I'll be real. I didn't need to stop for you. I've stopped for you to come through. No thank you. I look at them, I'm like, okay, I'm waiting for you to say thank you. I'm waiting for you to flash lights. If you don't flash it, then calm in it. It's not calm. Etiquette, man. Everything is that deep, man. Nah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Telling you, bro. That's even, that's even one sector. Manners. Who, oh, there was nothing I saw during the week that was like, manners, man. Please and thank you. When you mentioned X last week, that's when I forgot. Like, manners, bro. Like, if you ask for something, oh, yeah, please. I give you something, oh, yeah, thank you. Yeah. Like, imagine you're somewhere, someone's like, oh, yeah, give me that. Bro, what? <laughs> yeah, I'll say what. <laughs> bro, what? Like, you talk, give me that. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah safe. It you comes from, it comes from the home, though. It's just like good good home training to be honest like if you're not taught to say pe- uh, please and thank you then bro like do you know how angry I'll be like if I see my kid like with an adult take something and not say thank you oh my god oh my god now goodness. I'll pattern my kids though no, like there's certain course. things that I'll, yeah, that I'll you teach them it, like, like, you yeah. engrave that into them like Please and thank you anywhere you go, regardless of who you're dealing with. Yeah, that got instilled in me still by my parents. 100. Because if your kid doesn't say thank you, then I'm thinking, hey, what's his dad teaching him at home? Literally. It reflects on you. You know what I'm saying? Nah, even with my pops, like, my man, he don't, like, I can't say hello. Like, it's a straight good evening. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like he, he will make me say, he will make me say, he will say, like, huh? He would say it like 10 times yeah. and then be like, oh, good evening. <laughs> Do you get it? Like, hey. he, he's very particular with that. That's like, funny stuff. I'll direct that. Like, I'll, that's something I would do as well. Mm. 
with mad kids. Like that's one thing I picked up on him. Like, nah, he's mad particular with that. You know, some of my parents used to like prostrate to their parents to greet them in the morning. I don't know. I never had to prostrate to my parents. I never had. No, no, no. no so I our never, parents had to do it in Nigeria. To, to their, their parents, parents, apparently, some of them. That's something that gets dropped here, still. I can't. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, have, I don't never had to do that to my parents. I have to do it with aunties and uncles, yeah. and then. There's been occasions where my aunties or uncles will make me prostrate when I see my parents. I've seen that. No, that's happened to me as well. And it makes me feel like, like I don't want to be disrespectful, but it's like, oh, I know how to do with my nah, parents. I can't like, aunties and uncles, like, like, they do the most sometimes. And yeah, yeah, they yeah. actually do the most. Especially the fresh ones. That I've just but I would do the same thing like, though as banter though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're not serious. They're not serious. They're not serious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's just it's like, like, still like, like, doing the most. Uh, nah, no. Nah. The culture is the culture, isn't it? Like, I respect it. But it's just not something I would do anymore, which is bad at the same time. Like, I don't think I would make my parents, my kids, don't buy life for me. You, see, like you see when you man prostrate, like, does your hand touch the floor? Or, like, you do like a half hearted thing. Like, Everything's half hearted. Uh, it's half hearted, don't like, I think it's half hearted. I don't remember the last time I actually touched the floor. Yeah. I think, no, I think I'll touch the floor, but I don't go like full tilt. Like, my leg's not coming up the other so side. How do you touch the floor? <laughs> <laughs> that means Roski's bending. <laughs> Roski just squats. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't remember the last time I actually had to. Do. I don't think about it. I actually don't think about no, it. No, my leg goes up still. That's something well, I can push in. My left <laughs> leg, yeah. No, I'll just do that like, half hearted, like. Good evening, sir. I'll, I'll do just... that, yeah, and then they'll be like, eh? the whole thing. I say, yo, taking a piss, bro. Where does that even come from, man? You're taking a Mickey. I don't know. But I'll still do it. That's when there's a big crowd as well. Like, they wanna make That's when they like, want to go and make you do, do the whole like, thing. Come on, man. So, well, like, if there's, like, let's say there's a, you, co- you walk into a room full of aunties, um, aunties and uncles, are you doing this every single one of them? Nah, sir. So. <laughs> you got to do a general one, man. Or, like, a just quickly. Instagram. Yeah, it's a straight, it's a straight one, 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 one. <laughs> no, I'm so sorry. Like, if there's, like, three uncles in a row, like, yeah, good evening, uncle. Yeah, that's it. I'm not doing any three individual ones, bro. That's just, like, Oh yeah, allow that, yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I can't. Yeah, like, I'm yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, if you're in there, yeah, I will do it from far as well, like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I ain't coming to you to then go and do it. And True. some will say I've lost my. No, nah, I ain't lost it, but I've, I'm at the age now where. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's allow it. Man. You're doing that is a bit too much. Still. Yeah, you're like if you're if you're demanding it as well, like okay, cool. You're taking a piss, bro. It's calm. But I won't say that. But you're taking a piss. It's calm. You'll, you'll, you'll do it. That's what you'll do. Yeah, I'll probably do it. Like if you like, do you know what it is that. I, ain't, I can't remember the last time I was in it. Like, I, that's the thing. So that means I don't do it. Yeah. So I can't remember the last time I was in the situation where I had to actually do a like I only do it with people I haven't seen in a while or it's new people. So if yeah, it's a new person, yeah, then new I'll do it. New people. To yeah, show yeah, yeah. that, you get me? I was brought up correctly. Sure. But then at the same time, it's like, if you see someone that's Igbo or from another tribe, you don't need to do that. Huh? Swear. No, it's only Yoruba people. I didn't even know that. Yoruba. Is that how you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even know it was just our tribe. That's my own country. I mean, yeah, how you say it, bro? Westernized, bro. I'm westernized. Spent too much time. It's bad. Country, it's bro. bad. But yeah, I would. It's only. It's only. It's only them. Everyone, everyone else, you don't need to do it. Yeah, literally. They'll just know you are from there when you do that. But yeah, I learned that mistake as well. I didn't know ever. There was when I was young. I didn't know everyone was from different tribes. I thought everyone. There was one time. Europe, I, it? Yeah, I thought everyone's Europe. I thought Nigerians were all Europe. So I must have gone to my, my auntie's house one time. Her mum was there, I'm like, oh, a caroma. She's like, what? Bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is, but yeah, like, she, everyone understands. You're about, so she knew what I was saying, mm-hmm. but it's like, they're not from there, bro. So Yeah. What time they can speak a bit of it. So yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. I wish that they told us in it. Yeah. Our generation's robbed, I'll be real. Like, yeah. at this rate, none of our kids are speaking it. Yeah, no, it's definitely fall, it's definitely falling out. It's fading. It's yeah. going to fade out in the next time. Dramatically. Yeah, like, I know girls that can speak it. But they won't speak it to their kids. Mm. They won't. If you if don't you're not with a Yoruba it, man, you won't yeah, speak it. Bro. Like if you don't actually speak like you when you oh, when okay, you have a yeah, husband, they're mean. not gonna speak to their husband in Europe. They might speak it like like from time to time. I don't think well, so. Not like straight, normal. If language. you met, if you when you guys met, if you guys were speaking English, that's what you're speaking when you get married. Yeah, but then like when she's like turning them off or something like that, she might speak in Europe. Maybe, maybe to the kids. I thought it's like she'll do that if she wants to teach them that. If she wants to teach them, then my sister's teaching the kids, and even I don't know that. That's even poor. That's what I'm exactly. saying. Yeah, that's exactly. Poor. I don't oh, think that's so bad. I, to gonna, have to I know have one to guy that speaks Yoruba, you know, in this country. One, two, in fact. Off that's the bad. top of my head, I only know one. Yeah, truly. Maybe one or two. 
Do you think? Do you say you can speak it? Nah. So, so you say you can't speak it? I used to be able to hold a conversation, then I just wasn't. I didn't speak it for a long time, so it's like the thing is, I know a lot of people that can like they understand it fully. That's everyone, yeah, but they yeah. can't speak it. Yeah. No, Things like the people that speak it, their parents spoke it to them when they were a kid. Yeah. So they, as they grew up, that they picked it up. With yeah. Me, I just picked up of my parents, so I never really understood how to speak it, but I can say like the uh, the basics. But now I don't speak it, so it's like I've just dropped it. Yeah, I understand here and there only. That's it. But I've been trying to teach myself, so. Well, not teach myself, I had people trying to teach me here and there, so. I've picked up a few words, in it, mm. And it's like, when you understand a few words, then you can understand what they're trying to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you get it? The thing is, you're about, like, when you're getting insulted, like, you know. Well, yeah, you know. You know, like, yeah, the emphasis yeah, yeah. on a certain word, like, the body language, you it's know. The you're body getting, language, like, the face the they're face. making. The face, yeah. They're just screwing you out. It's my fault. It's my fault. Oh. Oh. Have you man seen um, the new Amazon hair salons? Um, yeah, I saw it. Um, what was it? I didn't really, I didn't really, really get into it. it like. Bro, like, basically, uh, Amazon, are, they're now doing hair in it. They're making their own ha- hair salons. And the prices are considerably cheaper than what you, that what girls would get if they went to like a normal hairstylist they found on Instagram. Like mm-hmm. they're doing braids for like 40 pounds. And that is cheap, cheap. And then I saw someone talking about it, saying, oh, we can't let them do this. We can't let them steal something from, you know. Our culture. Yeah, our culture. Let's keep it in-house, da 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 And then there was other people saying, like, the yeah, people in-house are overcharging us. Yeah. Like, it was, yeah. yeah, like, it was just an interesting, it was an interesting argument I was seeing, bro. I wish we had a girl on yeah. this podcast right now. But I feel like, I feel like. From what thing. I understand about hair status and all that, the prices are mad. That's all I know. They're crazy. They're if crazy. I was a girl, I'm going to Amazon. I'm going to Amazon, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Eco's tight, bro. Eco's tight, bro. Eco's tight, bro. Eco's tight, bro. <laughs> We're in a recession. <laughs> <laughs> pay forty pounds, Because if there's an Amazon barber that chins me up nicely and he's trimming me for ten, fifteen pounds, ten, 15, I'm 10 gone. Pound, ten pounds. Complaining. I'm gone. <laughs> like, cool. He's I'm under, gone. He's undercut the industry, but bro, I'm paying less. Yeah, like, I'm literally. gone, man. I'm gone. Us. I'm gone. I'm sorry. Like I understand supporting businesses and all that. Yeah. But your prices are killing me. <laughs> your prices are killing me. And the but, thing is, they know their prices aren't reasonable. Yeah. yeah. They know their prices aren't reasonable. But in the name of supporting yeah, businesses. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That you have to pay them. So what would you guys recommend? In terms of that, would you then tell them to reduce their prices to keep it in house? They would know. They would have to. They, or, or they'll lose all but the now I'm competing yeah, with yeah, Amazon, yeah. bro. Imagine yeah. if Amazon now is doing it way better. Like, your, your business is gone, bro. Or you, you actually have to just decrease your price. Decrease your prices, isn't it? Yeah, you have to, less profit potentially. Yeah, if you have to affirm it because you were violent to begin with. So uh, yeah. if that's Am- crazy. If Amazon's bro. quality is top. Yeah, like, Amazon is quality. Yeah, then yeah, it's done. Yeah, a lot of people are out of business. Quality yes. store. But would we want it now? Can't that's now? See now I hear the other side to it. That's like now we're making him even richer and we're fucking up our people's businesses, bro. They have to speak to our people and let them know the issues. But that again, that's like you see when um, companies or clothing brands say a bigger business copied their idea now, and everyone's going to that big business. Mm. Their marginal, I'm about to, their, no, I'm not revenue. Their budget is higher than ours. Yeah, their costs are lower than ours. Yeah, so it's like they can afford to charge that lower price because they're doing maybe bulk or whatever. Mm. Whereas we can't afford it. So our costs are higher. So that's why we have to charge higher. That's business. So if my costs are higher, I have to charge higher than someone. Let's say your costs are two pound, yeah. my costs are four pound. I have to charge higher yeah. to make profit. profit yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you get it? You can charge six pounds, make four pound. If I charge six pound, make two pound. I feel like that's if you're trying to make profit off the jump, like straight away. I mean, with business, that's what you should be looking to do. No? I mean, yeah, you should be, but at the same time, like, you don't in all businesses, you don't start off making profit. You just wait until you break even, and then you start going up, up, and up. Depends on the nature of the business, don't it? Yeah, because I feel with like with clothes, um, anything like um, that involves costs or materials, I think you should like get people to buy into the like maybe what the concept 
is on, of is your brand on, is. Yeah, on the of the brand is. And then as you start gaining more profit, then you can increase the um cost and all that. Yeah, and the quality yeah. of the material and everything yeah, like yeah, yeah. that. I think if you start off oh buying high quality material, buying high everything like that, of course you're gonna charge like one hundred pounds, two hundred pounds, stuff like that. High, yeah, exactly, because your costs are high. But I don't think they're I think they're unnecessarily high. You can start off lower. In a saturated market, that makes sense. But if you find a gap in the market, you might make profit pretty quickly. That is fair. That is because demand is there, bro. You ain't got that much competition. So that you might fair. actually might make profit fast without higher costs. Mm. Depends. Why did you have to say saturated? That's that's what. No, I understand what you say, but why did you have to say that? Because the clothing industry, the hair industry is saturated, bro. That's the def- That's it's, what the word is. Orgies. Orgies. A lot of people in the market, bro. Saturated, saturated, saturated. educate. Like, if they don't know, yeah, educate, yeah, educate. Like, educate. Saturated. I thought, okay, fair enough, fair enough. Saturated market. Sounding like jargon, bro. What? About? Yeah, see, I'm educating you guys now, bro. What? You know isn't what jargon, jargon is? Isn't jargon like rubbish. rubbish slang or something? Jargon is using big words to sound smart. No, 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 not to sound smart. Sure jargon is using big words is. unnecessarily. Jargon, let's see what that is. I swear down, bro. I'm to prove there's a reason why I'm like Saturated is a big word. No, not for me, of course. I'm words, but. Special words or expression used by a profession or a group that are difficult for others to understand. Saturated is not. Yeah, but it's not on. You were saying as if it's unnecessary. No, it's just a difficult word for them to understand. That's what I said. It's not even difficult. Okay, subjective. subjective, That's what I'm saying. Fair enough, but I'm just being pedantic. Yeah. Oh, now, now look who's been using jargon. What? What were we saying? I don't remember, man. I don't remember, man. Um, I was even going to shout out something. I can't remember, though. Oh, yeah, clothing brands, innit? If you've got clothes that you want us to wear on the podcast, innit? Mm. And then. Um, I'm joking, innit? No, I'm not joking. Not joking. I'm bro. not joking. DMs if you want us. Open, yeah, DMs are open, bro. DMs are open, Open to work with anyone still. I actually need to. Now, after that Balenciaga <laughs> hoo ha. Yeah. Man needs to readjust my wardrobe Facts. still, so. You've got clothing there that you want us to wear on the podcast. It's cold, soon. man. I need some hoodies, like. Yeah. So. No, nah, today was mad cold, bro. Mad, like, ugh. And I hate the cold. There's a, apparently there's, it's going to snow no. this week, yeah. What's snow today? Bro? Was it this country, though? Not this no. country. Was it in, like, London, though? Yeah. Mm. I said, apparently it was in the north. Yeah, it's definitely snowing. snowing. It was but it was snowing today, 100%. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I saw someone snap it still. It's actually very cold, like, it's crazy. You might wear gloves. No. No. Are you ever gonna wear gloves? No. Is that a oh. pride thing? <laughs> That's a pride. No, it's, just, it's not. Um, it's just not. It's not necessary. For yeah. Me, no, but like when it gets to a certain degree, it's not, it's, not it's not conventional. It's not conventional. Like, huh? let's say it you want to use your phone. Yeah, you can't touch your phone. You're gonna what? Take off your glove and then use your phone and uh, put it back on. When it gets to a certain temperature, you get. I remember we have, shuffle. We, we used to do that. Take my phone out, <laughs> bro. Fair, fair, fair. When it gets to like minus, I'm not shuffle, bro. I walk. I'm not I, touching I, I my phone. I can't shuffle my playlist. I like. I have good playlists. I can shuffle them, but I want to hear certain songs in it. Do you know what I'm saying? You do that before. When you go outside, you leave it, bro. Do you not <laughs> listen to the same songs every day? I mean, certain songs, yeah, I will listen to uh, every day. Yeah, there's daily songs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Daily songs, yeah, true. Bro, I've got to the point where I'm listening to the same song every day. Same song? Songs. Oh. Like, I heard the song yesterday, the day before yesterday. Every every single day I heard the same song. It's R&B. It's just different genres, bro. It's more Afrobeats now, bro. Like, I'm more into my Afrobeats. I wish I was going to Nigeria this year. Christmas, innit? Here in Nigeria, Christmas is a vibe. Dirty December, bro. I know people that go every single year without fail, bro. Every single year without fail. Well, obviously, if you weren't able to go to Nigeria this year, innit? Um, Platinum events are doing Plasma Masquerade, 1st of, Dece- 1st of January, 2023. Make sure you get your tickets. Tickets are selling out, so quick plug. But yeah. Link in the description. But yeah. Let me quickly do my hot take. Hot take. So this week's hot take is, since we were discussing something, you know, a bit on the PG side is, what is your hot take on friends with benefits? Uh, hot take on friends with benefits, it... Does it work, yes or no? Pardon? Does it work, yes no, or no? No, it won't work. It won't work. It can't work. <sighs> See, it can't I've work. got, uh, my answer's weird. Like, yes or no? Do you friends with benefits work? work? Nah, they don't. Damn. Damn. And the thing is, yeah, like you can even have someone that like both of you purely just enjoy doing whatever you do together, yeah. But it's a thing where one when one person goes off to another person now, it's like 
Oh, you're someone's doing, pride is hurt, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're doing something that we used to do with someone else. You might not even like that person. You just like what you're doing, but you're doing it with someone else. Mm. So you're still going to get attached in some way. Literally. You get subconsciously jealous as well. Maybe not even yeah. subconsciously, maybe even consciously jealous that. Like. Yeah. I think it can work. Nah, nah, nah. But nah. It, it works till it serves its time, for, for it to serve its time, serves its purpose. Yeah, but it Wait, doesn't ever does it, end. Why does it come to an end? Friends with benefits is not long term, bro. You might as well get with the girl then if you want it long term. It never ends mutually though. That's facts. Yeah, but it served its purpose. You are my friend with benefits. I've got my benefit from you, bro. That's from your perspective. There's always bro. one person that didn't want it to stop. Bro. Yeah. It's never going to end. So it didn't really time. serve its purpose if both of parties course. were happy. How? Because one, one person didn't really like want to stop it, but yeah. they had to stop it out like reluctantly. Unless you both actually agreed that, oh, let's stop this now. Which rarely ever happens. Yeah. Yeah, but bro, the term is friends with benefits. I've yeah. got my benefit. My benefit is to get me, you get me, duh, duh, yeah. duh. Yeah. At some point it's going to end whether I end it or you end it, bro. <laughs> At the end of the day, if we remain friends, then it worked. Do you think that's likely though? To remain friends with the person? Yeah. If you know what we're both on, then yeah, sure. Even then, I still think it's a risky one, man. It's like saying, but where I feel like it don't work is like you're saying now, okay, cool, you and your ex break up now, let's just continue doing oh, friends no, with benefits. No, no, no. Like, no, someone's going to fight. too techy. Come on. Yeah. Well, I, I think people are territorial naturally though. Man, they're man, woman. Like, yeah. if you're involved with a woman doing friends with benefits, let's say in the workplace now, which is even dumb. Oh, <laughs> And then you lot now stop, and then she's now always talking to another you. It's like, even though you're done, you're like, <sighs> I found like that I, I wouldn't care. You say that. I, I no, 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 you I say care. that though. I, I promise. You say that. Wait, though. if you two ended, and yeah, then you yeah, see yeah, her talking yeah. to someone else, yeah, I don't keep care. her. But, but, but you didn't very end off of your them. terms though. She ended it. And like, I'm not the type of guy to like. I don't care. Like, if you want to get say real, bro, I keep a hundred. I'm keeping that. I'll. I'll kind of. Yeah. Keep like, bro, if I purely saw her as just, you know what I'm saying, that, then... Bro, bro, you didn't want it to end, though. Yeah, I didn't want it to end, but I didn't see her as anything else. I'm not going to be that fast. I'm not going Keep to be Keep it back, I am still. I'm not going to be that fast. I'm fast, I'm fast. Go talk to whoever you want, like... <laughs> I'm fast. That's why I tell myself to make myself feel better. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But I'm, I'm still fast, man, I'll be real. Like, I'm very fast. Because me... Oh, why, why are you fast? Why are you fast? I'm territorial, bro. But it's the thing where, like, would you want to be with a girl that does friends with benefits? Like, would you cuff a girl that's done friends with There we go. So why would you care? See, but it's I wouldn't ask though, so I wouldn't know. But this girl has done it with you. Yeah. So she, the chances are that she could have done it with someone else. What's friends with benefits, though? Like, you guys are literally... You talk. You talk, but... Do you? Yeah, I, I assume you would. Maybe a bit of like, yeah, I'm coming over in five minutes. Yeah, but even when you're, even when you come over, <laughs> no, that's that's talk. Like, not like, even, how was your day, kind of thing. That's not, yeah, that's not running. But like, even when you come over and you're doing your thing, like you, you're gonna talk, you're gonna be talking in it. Like, yeah. Oh, at some points, isn't it? Like, you know, it's not gonna be hundred percent doing it all the time. Like, unless I don't know what you guys. Are. I didn't fucking say you guys. Bro. I didn't say shit. <laughs> Weird, I didn't say nothing, bro. <laughs> Why do you guys keep doing this to me? <laughs> I didn't say anything. Did you, did you turn off? You, yeah, like, <laughs> it's done, man. Dude. Well, you man, let's just wrap this episode up, man. Wait, did the recording get? Is it recording now? I've, yeah, I put on now. Well, it's just, bro. It's a sign, bro. If it turns off yeah, again, then it's done, bro. Is, like, what the hell? Is going on? Did it turn off again? No, no, it's calm, but. I'm confused. Bro, it's like, it's a sign, bro. <laughs> Keep it a buck, it's a sign, bro. It is what it is. It is what it is, man. I ain't really trying to wrap up this conversation yet, though, but yeah. Yeah, the next time it does it, it will done, it? But yeah. Okay. Sneaky links are calm, still. Not that I run it, but it's calm. Yeah, but- I it's... think those, they, they can run, but I feel like if you if both parties know what the angle is, it runs until it runs. It runs its course, bro. Yeah, but even if you tell, let's say you tell her, oh, listen, man, we're not this. Explicitly tell her, listen, we're not this. Yeah. Even when, like, down the line, you start doing certain stuff, she's going to act like you are that, even though you've told her you're not that. You know what I'm saying? They're not logical, bro. They're emotional. You're always going to run into that. Always. Yeah, but at the same time, you know. The only way, I think the only way it can work is if, like, let's say whenever you're done with what you're doing, one of you has to leave straight away. 
There's no talking. You're there for that purpose and that purpose only. Yeah, that's out. That's out. You, they can't you. be getting to know each yeah, other. Yeah. They can't be that's that. That's where the attachment yeah, starts. Yeah, no, but you're already friends. Huh? You're already friends. Yeah, then that's what you go wrong, maybe. Maybe that's where you go wrong. No, because the term maybe is that's friends why, benefits. Yeah, maybe that's why it doesn't work. Because you're actually friends. No, but DP, if you start talking every time after the sesh, like... You're going to get attached. Yeah. She'll be like, oh, so did you like, chat to that person I worked today that you said didn't want to talk to you? Like, you're, you know about <laughs> each other's life now. <laughs> you, know, you know about each other's life. It's crazy. It's crazy. Nah, like, you can't do that, man. I'm sorry. But that's why, I, like, if she wanted to go and do it with someone else, I honestly wouldn't care. Honestly. Wait, so let's say, like, <laughs> let's say you're in a situation where you go, yeah, you want to cuff her, but she wants friends with benefits. I got firm though. You want to cuff her, but she, but she wants, wants to friends continue doing friends. I'm running benefits. the friends with benefits until I can be able to cuff her. Do you think that's going to be a high chance of success? Yes, bro. I'm a striker. Theoretically, that, uh, you it's a risky could path. do that. It's a risky path. What do you lose at the end of the day, bro? I guess. I mean, you're going to try and run through the sneaky link path to then cuff her, but she cuts you off before you get there. Then yeah, you are heartbroken, but that's the risk I will take because I like her. That's, not, that's what you lose out on if she and, and I still get the benefits. So it's like, yeah, I guess, I guess, like, yeah. But I mean, not what you actually wanted. Like you get the benefits, but you don't get to cover because that's what you wanted to do. Yeah, like let's like your friends with benefits, and let's say she does it with someone else now. But why would I want her? If all she wants is a friends with benefits. That's what I'm saying. That's exactly what I'm saying. Why would that? And I'm saying, why would you care if she talks to someone else? If you no, no, I would care still. Why are you forming an attachment with someone that you wouldn't cuff? There we go. That's the question. That's the not territorial, bro. I'm naturally territorial. I'm naturally territorial, bro. I get you would be a little bit annoyed, but like, like if you're, if let's say you're with your sneaky, like you linked your sneaky link <clears> yesterday. <throat> now she comes to your graph, you do whatever, da da da. You go to her motive the next day. Now you see her chatting to a bear man, get muted, bro. Like, bro, what? I don't know what you expected. <laughs> I don't know. You did sneaky link with her. Oh. She's trying to beg guys. What's the, what, what? I don't see what the issue is I'm, there. I'm I don't know. I'm Me possessive. personally, I don't, yeah, like, I don't really like it. Like, I feel like with a girl that can do friends with benefits, there's no, she's not bound to anything. There's nothing, she has no rules. There's no nothing like. Okay, you haven't stated it, but in your head, she is bound to something. Well, that's it's how not, I would act. It's not me. What's she like, bound to? This contract. So the contract doesn't state that she has to only talk I'm, to That's me. what I'm saying. She's not actually... There is no contract. That's the would thing you have to lay down benefits. the laws like that? Yeah, you would have to. Oh, in you have to benefits. say it even if you don't believe it, I'll be real. You have to. <laughs> say what? <laughs> that that contract. like, you're free to do what you want, even though you might not be okay with no, being cap. free. No, cap. Cap. Yeah. Cap. Mean cap. I would never enter something where you're allowed to go and do stuff with other people, bro. Then you... No, that's I can't lie to you. That's what friends with benefits is. So you'd actually have to say, oh, by the way, you can't do anything with anyone else while we're doing friends with benefits. Yeah. So you, would you do friends with benefits with a girl and she's doing da 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 with other guys? I wouldn't want to know that. Yeah. But if but I found out, is. if I found out, I would stop doing it with her. But like, if I don't know, I don't care. But she's not. But what's the whole point it? of? Do- yes, she is, bro. Because why are you doing friends with benefits with me if you know you can get da 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 from other guys, bro? <laughs> bro. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, maybe I said she- that's the whole point of it. Like, <clears throat> because you can't, you like, you just can't be able to go outside and do stuff with other people. But it's not exclusive, you though. Just- well, or maybe she's speaking to your attraction. I said friends with benefits is exclusive. I don't know. I think there's different types of contracts. I just rather. I don't know because that it's like why then it's like why do you get angry? I don't know. I the don't thing know. is, yeah, I'd say I'd rather not know, but then like that I means you're not doing it with other people. While I'm yeah, I that's know, mad. I don't know mm. about that. So man. okay, you're doing friends with benefits with, benefits with this girl. Yeah. And let's say you find another girl attractive. Yeah. You're not going to do anything with her because you're in friends with benefits. Why are you asking me that question, bro? That's what I'm saying. No, 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 I've had enough, I've had enough. What are you trying to do to me right now, buddy? You trying to throw me under the bus? This is all theoretical, but that's what I'm saying. Like, it wouldn't matter. And that girl shouldn't get angry either. You're going to go do your thing with her because she's still getting the goods as well. Nothing's changed. You're just entertaining both girls. Why does she care? That's what friends, that's what friends with benefits to, to me, me I feel like it's I would only ever enter something like that bear in mind I probably even wouldn't if it's exclusive bro like you ain't going to no other guys love it fam why you like whoa whoa what's this all about like yeah. no allow that you're in a relationship I, man I ain't got no issues with you like no. Nah. wait so you're saying that you're fine with her doing it and then she's doing other guys as well if I find out 
I'm not doing it with her anymore. But if I don't know, I don't care. Like, I think that's something that would be, that's a something that doesn't have to be said though. Like if you're, if we're doing friends of benefits, I don't want to know if you're doing anyone else. All right, cool. So let's, you say, she, let's say she's your sneaky link now. Yeah. And she now goes and hugs someone like Gemma went and hugged that brother. She what? Sorry. She went to hug that guy. That what? No, that, that guy that Gemma hugged. In front oh, of Nicole. Oh, 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 yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. She goes and does that in front of you. Yeah, she done still. Done. Contract ripped up, bro. Contract done. I don't really, I, I, unless she actually tells me, oh, I'm doing him on the side as well. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Like, if she says that, I'm done in it. Other than that, so I don't care. So she doesn't say it, you're just going to see as normal. I don't care. You're not my girl. You can hook who uh, you want. You can hook who you want. You can jump though, and hug and I, I wish I was like you. Same. But I'm, I, I know my, I'm not like that. I, I think uh, with me, yeah, friends with benefits, I know myself. I would never, I could never get attached. I can never get, I can never get attached. I'm sorry. Do you mind catch feelings quickly? Yeah, man. Same. What? Not off that. Like if I know what this is in my head, then I know. No, generally, generally. Ge- yeah, generally. probably. What's Maybe. quick? I don't even know. What is quick? What is quick then? Couple conversations. Mm-hmm. Couple mm. conversations? Goodness gracious. I feel like that. you can start feeling the girl. What is that catching feelings? Yeah. Yeah. That's a crush, bro. Like, let's say, let's say you buck her for the first time tomorrow if you buck her let's say twice in the next week and both of those times it's done you get me it's done, it's there's done. FaceTimes in between then it's, it's, done, done, it's done bro it's I done like it's, it's done. done it's done like it's mm. done. within five to seven business days it's done bro I'm you're feeling you. her and you're getting to know her yeah. yes especially if this is someone that you like and yeah. she likes you or like you're both attracted to each other it's long still and every time you see a box is just getting ticked off ticked off ticked off I'm telling you bro it's intense mm. you actually bro I guess there's, not, there's nothing you can do. I mean, I, I think that's still, I think that's different to actually, like when you say I'm feeling her or I've caught feelings for her. I think those are two different things. I can't lie. They are. Yeah. Feeling her is the first, like, the first, first thing, little. Yeah. That's, that's what, that's, that's, that's what I'm talking that's about. That's yeah. going for like a month. Yeah, I caught feelings. So you can catch feelings in a couple conversations. Not I can, I can, feeling I can start feeling you. Yeah, okay, cool. There's the clarification. Yeah, I can have feelings for you after about two, three weeks. Yeah, true. That's that's fair wow, enough. That's so dangerous, man. That's, oh, fair that's why I don't like to engage with it yeah, like that. Same. Because like, yeah. it's dangerous. I don't like when my heart's played with. Yeah, man. I'm nah. a softy inside. Oh. But outside my heart is cold. Very cold, man. You have to break it down to get inside, man. Three weeks. And the thing is that when you get to that three point, you have to tell yourself, yeah, like I'm finishing, I'm finishing this. Like I'm not losing here, bro. Finishing what though? What's the Bro, what's the aim? Like, what's the goal? She's not your girl yet. You have to finish the job. What are you talking? What are you talking about? Three weeks in, you've caught yeah. feelings. What's your goal here? You want to oh, make her a girl? Yeah, that's what oh. I'm saying. Oh, okay. You might yeah. be in competition. You're, if I've caught feelings, you're not. I can't oh. lose here, bro. Oh. I can't lose. Oh. Should I finish? No, Should I not I've, finish, bro? The minutes I've caught feelings, she uh, she's feeling me as well, bro. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that's yeah, true. that's true. I've that's never true. been in a situation where I like her and she don't like me. Yeah, exactly. No, never been in that situation. No. Yeah, because I I can only start to catch feelings because I'm getting the vibe that you like me. Reciprocation. Yeah. So, no, no, no. At that point, I've already finished the job. Job's no, done. But it's not <laughs> done yet, bro. <laughs> it's, it's not. It's, it's close, but it's not done yet. Bro. But you're, mm, you're well on the I way. I feel like in that stage, it's still very fragile. As in, like you can do one thing and then it's gone. Yeah, because you're still trying to get to know the person and all that. No, yeah, get to know. But at the same time, like when you're moving to a girl, it's you trying to pursue her. Pursue, yeah, you're still pursuing her. You're still in that stage where you're still pursuing. You should do you believe it's pursue. like that, though. Huh? Do you believe it's like that? Where like, a guy's pursuing a girl? Do you like? Do you feel like it should always be a guy's pursuing the girl? I don't feel like it should always be like that. If a girl was pursuing a guy. Be a different type of feeling, but I don't. Well, shouldn't it be like you're both trying to impress each other? Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. yeah, but initially though. Initially, um, when I say initially, I'm talking to you, like maybe about going up to her to get a Snapchat or number, taking her out. Yeah. Then there should be a mutual understanding that we're feeling each other, and then it should be we're trying to secure each other. That's yeah. my idea yeah, of yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It's not. I'm chasing you until I cuff you. You're my girlfriend now, and then boom. Yeah. Like for me, that's not how it is. That's 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 not how it should be. 
But you know, each of their own. I everyone has their different opinions on it. I just feel like that's how it should be. So everyone's working to make this a unit right. rather yeah, than it just yeah. be I'm working for it. Yeah. To then not be a unit. That's what I'm saying. I feel like it when you're still pursuing the girl, is you're pursuing up to the point where she realizes that it's now a two way thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She can set pace though. She can move to me, but I'm taking control. I mean, I don't know how that dynamic would even work. So what, is she going to keep moving to you? No, 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 no. As in like the first time she no, sees you, the first time she sees you, yeah. she approaches you. Yeah. And then once the conversation starts, you take control. Okay. So did you move her then? No. No, she moved me. So would she have to pursue you? No. Nah. So you would pursue her? I would step up, but she has to maintain as well. Fez. Obviously, it's not... I feel like that, that, the dynamic is just weird. It's... it's, it's it's not weird, but it's different because you, when you, when you first move a girl, like you're showing interest in her. Yeah. So no. Oh yeah. 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 You're showing interest in her. So like, you obviously like her more than she would like you. Yeah. To an extent. Yeah. But in this day and age, a lot of girls can move guys. So I think what he was trying to say is, the minute she moves me, if I feel like I can feel her a little bit, or like she's like, yeah, she's worth me trying to pursue, mm-hmm. I'll switch the dynamic of out now to start to take control of trying to pursue her. Even though she moved to me, I'll still be pursuing you to then get to that balance. Even though I already know that you're feeling me. Yeah. So it's just weird. It's a weird one. I can't even lie. Like if a girl ever moves to me and I just don't know how, I don't know how things would work out. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, she moves to me, so she clearly likes me more. Am I supposed to now be the one doing all of this and that and everything? Step up. You would step up if you if feel like, she's like, yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I guess, yeah, it's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I don't know what you say if you don't know. Yeah, if you're not feeling her, then you're gonna air her, innit? Like. <laughs> what are you gonna say right there though, like? What are you gonna say? Oh, go oh is this in real life? Yeah. Oh yeah, I got Oh, girl. thank you. I got nah, she'll come up to you with dead game. Oh yeah, you're good looking still, thank you. That's, uh, Thank you. I appreciate it, darling. Thank you. You're saying, uh, but what did you say? I'll just say thank you, darling. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I'm just going to try and carry on something if she's really No, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. For- I have the conversation, bro. I'm not going to dead her off because I don't want to be rude to her because it's she's been brave to come to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, it's true. But girls won't do that. So I'll make her feel better. Like, Wait, like, what? Is say it? girls won't do that. They'll be around. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They will never do that. Well, they okay. will yeah, absolutely, that's they that's will facts. absolutely and deal with care. you. They will just expect you to do something for yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They will absolutely yeah. deal with you, still. But no, I would, I'll make her feel like she's yeah, still calm, like she's cool, like got to know each other. But if she asks me for my my number or something, <laughs> luckily I've never. I don't think I've been in a position where I've had to turn down a girl that's asked for my number or Snapchat, or whatever. Yeah, I just gave my old snap. Nah, I don't think I've ever had to turn the girl down. I just, the conversation never got to that. I'll be like, oh, hold on. <laughs> and do what? You turn around? Oh, now nah, go to someone else. <laughs> go speak to someone else. That's rude. <laughs> That's rude. That's, That's not rude, though. Cool, but you're not coming back. Like, yeah, I'm not coming back, though. You're not coming back. That's you need to say selling. bye. That's dream selling. She's waiting, bro. Nah, she's not. Imagine if she'll get, get it. She'll get, a, she'll get a message. Uh, she'll get a message. She'll get a message. Dream selling. <laughs> Dream selling, that's so wicked, man. Come on, man. The guy, come on, don't put that on Hustler, man. I'm not a dream seller. Ask any girl. I've never dreamed. I've never sold a dream to anyone. Have you? Me? Me, back in the day when I was a young and reckless guy, fam. This is what I'm saying. He's a different Benzo now, bro. No, I mean, you just got to be... The Benzo I knew back in the day. Chai! Out and about. It's not good, man. You have to respect respect females. Yeah, yeah, 100%. 100%. 100%. I've had to learn that as well, still. Oh, yeah. 100% I learned that. I think I've even learned that because of him slightly, you know. Because of me. Mm. Because of you, yeah. Inspiring a lot of people, man. How did you how did you learn to respect females through him? No, 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 no. We all know how to respect <laughs> women. Certain no, things what was picked up from Benzo. Why? How? Do you mean why? Do you know, that guy, we, man, we learned that from guy. each other, bro. We yeah, we learned from each other, man. We've learned from Are you gonna tell me you've never learned anything off him? Or you... Not to do with women, no. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm generally baffed. Why? <laughs> what? The only thing I've learned from this guy is something like, oh yeah, you don't need to always get angry in certain situations. Yeah, that can apply to women. 
No, because it like can, it, you know exactly what I was talking I mean, about. It can, it can but can. Like, I've never learned that because like I've never yeah. been like, oh yeah, what would Benzo do? <laughs> like, I'm not saying you said that, but I'm just saying that like, what would Benzo do? No, yeah. I've never. No, I've just like, like, oh yeah, like I can see that he's cooled down from back in the day. Like yeah, like, that's something that I've learned. But in terms of no, I've never anything that I've learned towards females is or women, sorry, is based on my experience with women. Yeah. So I've learned from my previous mistakes. Oh, yeah. That's how I've learned. And advice. Genuinely. And then obviously advice, if you guys advise me, I would. Which is what I'm saying. This guy's never advised me a day in his life, bro. You advise me? Oh yeah, so oh, that's, that's, that's how you've learned, bro. That's, I, that's this guy I'm don't saying. advise me. So, do you ask for his advice though? No. <laughs> I, I probably definitely advise you, but you, you definitely you don't listen. Let me tell you, let me tell you his advice. Me. Yeah, leave her, man. Leave her. I, I, I don't think I've ever said that. <laughs> oh no, but the thing is, that's good advice as well, though. That's it actually depends. good advice. Why? Like, if I'm telling you to leave it, I'm saying leave it, bro. Like, don't respond to the situation or you said don't react along, to the situation. Said something like that before. Or like, yeah, it's that's, not worth it or something like that. Yeah, something along those lines, isn't it? Like, that is advice in itself. To be fair, it is, yeah. But in terms of how to treat a woman, nah. Oh, no, no, no. no. Nah. You, should, you should learn that from. I learned that through experience. I'm still learning, though. I'm still young, so. Oh, nah. Do you guys do that thing that's um, always posted on um, TikTok, the the sidewalk rule, the pavement yeah. thing? Yeah. 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 Okay. Cool. Just yeah. Making sure. My dad told I can't me. remember where I, no, my, no, I didn't learn that from anyone. Like, I learned that by myself, though. Sure. I don't know how I learned it, though. I think I was naturally doing it. Genuinely, I was naturally doing that. And then I saw a TikTok that said that men should do that. And then I instantly was like, Every time I have to make sure yeah, I'm yeah, like that. Yeah, 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 same. Like, I think that was, I would naturally do it and then sometimes I'd forget. Yeah, sometimes I'd forget, yeah. yeah. And I was my cousin. Yeah, why would you? The thing is, if you don't do it, they're not going to see. Nah, they, might. they might. They might. They might because of TikTok now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But in I general. Think it's that deep, though. Like, no, I don't think it's that deep when they tell you because you might have just forgotten that you just what, quickly switch places, but. <laughs> <laughs> How would they tell you though? They'd be like, oh, you know, you know, the guy's supposed to walk closer to the road. Oh, yeah, okay. I've never been told. Yeah, like exactly. That, yeah. It's not that, yeah, it's never yeah, that yeah. deep though. It's never that deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've definitely been told. It's never that. that deep. Do you mind the whole doors open? No. Yeah. You do. You don't. Like. You know, sometimes I feel like I hate on myself. <laughs> What? Genuinely, because how can I say straight away, nah? Like, when I have, bro, like, I do open doors. I don't, when, it, when you said that, I was thinking my car, nah, I don't open my car door, no. Like, only if I'm trying to banter them, like, oh, I'll, I'll open it, be like, oh, yeah, get in, princess, or some bullshit like that. But opening a, a door for like a restaurant, yeah, I'll do that. Mm. My car, like, nah. But restaurant, yeah, 100%. I opened the door for one girl one time, she said, nah, 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 I don't like the door being like, I can't lie to you. Yeah. If a girl said that to me, I'm still opening the door. Like, no, I, I still did, but I was yeah. like, she's like, don't do it again. I said, like, I'm kind of off still. What's oh, going on here? What's going on here? Yeah, I'm kind of like, you see me, I'm quick with it now. I'm <laughs> sifting, like, it's done. Yeah, yeah it's calm. Like, you're yeah, replaceable, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you're calm, replaceable. Man. I said, don't open the door for me, bro. What, what sort of toxic nonsense are you trying to bring to me right now? I didn't even understand why. I'm, I'm just trying to be nice. Just being a gentleman, bro. Literally. So, you guys don't open, you don't open car doors. What like, like I said like I'm in the driver's seat and I'm opening the passenger door. No, like, no, I said like you're walking different. to the car. Yeah, like you're both. And I'm going around to her side to open the door. Open for the her. door. Yeah. Like, nah. 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 Like, for you know, is, like once in a blue moon, if I'm trying to joke with them, like they will take us a joke because oh, yeah, like yeah, it's yeah, not, yeah. It's, it's like it's not something that you need to do. As such. obviously, some people say yeah, he needs to do it, but the girls I've encountered, the girls I've been speaking to, nah, it's not that necessary. But. If it's a cab, I was gonna say, then I would. I think it's a bit different because now I'll just enter in from behind, don't it? Yeah. Pause. Oof, that's not even a pause. That's, that's a that's mad good. statement. I'm though. glad you caught yourself. That's a mad statement, though. I was about but to say. Yeah, I'll just get in behind, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah. I think that's a bit different, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm a, there is, I'm a nice guy, I'm a gentleman. Sometimes they just bring out the It's women that can bring out the worst in you. So do you think every, actually, not probably not, every girl you might have interacted with would call you a gentleman? Every woman, would they call me a gentleman? Not everyone. Percentage. It's not looking good. It's not looking good, <laughs> I don't think. Well, like less than 50. What's um, a gentleman though? Like what's certain things like? That's, that's an example. Opening the doors? Yeah. I don't know, man. You know, women can disgrace you sometimes, man. Yeah, you won't know the can. truth about you until they talk. So I actually don't know. The thing is like, 
Like if I'm not chatting, oh, I don't know, man. <laughs> no, say it, say it, say it. You have to say that. Yeah. I don't know, man. Like, if I don't actually like, for example, for example, if I was for, for some reason maybe taking out my friends to benefit, I'm not opening the door for you. <laughs> I'm not opening the door for you. Why? Why should I open the I'm door? I'm not walking you? on the, the closest oh, to the yeah, car, yeah, man. Don't care, How like, you get there, bro? You take that risk. <laughs> nah, uh-huh. it is that. Genuinely, I'm not. I've never. No, I don't know. I actually don't know. I don't know what they will tell me. I, maybe I'll ask one them one one day. Cause. I feel like you mature though, so that. Yeah, you mature, so like you don't really like yeah. me at 17, 16, 18, I'm not the same as 22 now. 21, mm. 22, I'm not the same. So maybe people in my recent years, they'll be like, yeah, he's a nice person, but like yeah. obviously there were some things that he just didn't do. Mm-hmm. But in general, I would like to say people think I'm a respectful person or I'm a, I'm a gentleman. It's my friends that I think will be able to tell me that, yeah, he's, yeah, he's a nice person or whatever. Nice. And that does matter to me a little bit, you know? Nah, man, nah, if your friends nice say that you're a gentleman or a nice person, like, like, cause I will always say I'm not nice. I don't know why I always say that. But you say you're fair, bro. I'm fair, but I feel like my friends know I've got them. I feel like that matters to me. Yeah. That at least they know I've got them. So if my friends know that, then it's true that like, I've got you in it. So that's the most important thing to me. But girls in the past, hmm, they're not right there, it? But I ain't got no issues with anyone in the past. Unless they fight me and I ain't fight them, in it. But you know, each of that one, innit? Who's the nicest out of us? Not me. Oof, might be me. The nicest. Might be me, still. It depends the on the context, innit? Yeah. Yeah, what's, yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing is, I've heard that people say I'm blunt. You, you blunt? blunt. Damn blunt. I've seen you be blunt. Yeah, like, I, blunt. I don't know when I'm being blunt. That means you're definitely blunt. That means you're doing it subconsciously. Yeah, like when I'm talking to people, mm. apparently I'm blunt. I don't know. But I, 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 I would like to say I'm a nice guy. <laughs> I would like to say I'm the nicest here. Yeah. But I, <laughs> yeah. I was brave. I was so I would like brave. to say I'm the nicest I can't really call it who's the nicest actually. Oh, I don't think none of us are not nice. Yeah, I don't know. But I'm also very, I don't think I'm the nicest here because I feel like I'm the very most straight, not straight, so all straight up. I ripped them I know you want to say very yeah, straight. Yeah, like, yeah, I'm yeah. very, do you get yeah. it? I say how it is, bro. I don't care if I hurt your feelings. I say how it is. So that's why I'll say it. It's not me, but I'm nice. No. Yeah. I think we're all nice though. I think all our friends will say what? No, they'll say you're the rudest. Back in the day, you were the rudest, Hans Blunt. They'll say I'm the nicest, 100%. What, back in the day, was he not the rudest? Yeah, they would probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah bro, it was you, bro. Like, I was, no, bro. Sometimes I will look at it and be like, bro, you know what? You know what you just said, bro. No cap, bro. What? Me? That's what I'm saying when we're, when we're young. And well, I'm talking back in the day, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back in the day, hundred percent. Think. Bro. No, like a million percent, bro. I need an example. I, I'm actually, my mind's blank here, bro. It's, it's, I can't think of it. That like, it was actually years ago. Actually, me. No, yeah, hundred yeah, percent. You were, like you were mean, not mean, but not mean, not bro, mean, but like. like I didn't have to say that. You could say some shit like, whoa. Like, like. I don't want to say it was disrespectful. Not disrespectful, but, but like, it's, like, it's borderline, yeah, like, yeah, whoa. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's like borderline cheeky slash disrespectful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, that, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that yeah, makes yeah, more yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes more sense. That makes yeah. more sense. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, can, I can hear that. Yeah. But now it's like, none of us are actually rude. Well. Nah, not rude. Not rude, okay. but. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'll just leave it at that, innit? None of us are like that. I think we're all cool now. We're cool guys. Cool guys. I feel like we know who we can get away being rude to. That makes sense. Because they know or your she, character or whatever. Exactly. Yeah. Like I'm saying. But I wouldn't just go outwardly go and be rude to people. Like, that's why I say none of us are rude. Because a rude person will go up to people, random people and just be like, or some could ask me, shut up. Like, none of us would do that. You help someone, you know? Yeah. Wait, so you actually think you're the nicest? I, I, I want to say you're the nice. I think I, we're all, I think we're all equally well, nice. I bet if we were to ask our friends, especially female friends, they'll say I'm the nicest. They'll say you're a ghost. That and because you're a ghost, that's why you come across as the nicest. nicest. Yeah, there we go. It's as simple as that. Because you have the, the least interaction. <laughs> least interaction, yeah. And every time I interact, that's I'm nice. Fair. That's by sample size. Simple that doesn't even count. Simple as that. Sample size. That doesn't even count. That doesn't count. Oh, yeah. Oh. If we ask our female friends, I'll be the, I would not be the nicest. Should we call one right yeah. now? No, because I wouldn't be the nicest, bro. See, cause you don't like the answer, but you shouldn't call one. Cause we know that they're gonna say it's not me because I actually like, 
You get me? No, but it makes sense why they wouldn't say you though. No, because- But they're not calling you rude. No, because character. they could call me rude. Because of how I am to them. No, but sometimes you're, nah, sometimes you're borderline. Nah. <laughs> no way you're talking about me. Who, what? Him. Yeah, but the thing is, you know what you're doing though. Exactly. They know that's, that's, that's you. They know that's me, innit? Yeah, that's why, that's, why I, I, that's why I can't call myself because yeah. they know what, what it is. Like, it's banter. Yeah. That's literally what it is. Because comparing it to what... No, bro, you know what it was back in the day, bro. Don't even chat out. Like, you know what it was. Man, you could actually say some shit like... It's off. No, no, no. Just... But you could say something and be like... Like, we could actually be like, whoa. Like, genuinely. I'll be like, whoa. I can't remember any whoa things that I said, though. No, I used to, like, again... Used to be cheeky slash disrespectful. Yeah, like it was like more like than uni this, or huh? before uni. Before uni, I can't remember, man. No. Around those days, yeah, around those around days, days, isn't it? Like, around those okay. days. Um, kind of. Do you know? I was, I was looking on our, our TikToks. Yeah, there was a comment someone said about you. I think we've already seen it. It was like, oh, no, it was the toxic masculinity one. Yeah. And someone must have said something like, let me get up right now. It was so funny. I was I looking at it the other day. Watch, I don't even remember what, I'm just laughing. What's, what's toxic masculinity again? Was it the crying one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This person was like, oh, Tina and a real friend. I thought this guy was early on the pod to get scrum. <laughs> I died when That's I my read boy. that. <laughs> <laughs> I died when I read that. That's no. facts though. That's facts though. That you're only on here to get scrum. What did he say before that bro? <laughs> Look at him. Look I didn't him, hear because I turned him. out, bro. I actually turned out. That, that is level five damage. Can you imagine? Imagine you need to get his room. Wait, what was the, what was the first? clip that. What did Oi. the person comment? What did the person comment? T9 is a real friend. I thought this guy was only here on the pod to get some. Oh, that's your person, isn't it? Yeah. 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 That was funny, so. Can you imagine? This guy said, oh, you need to get his room. But that could have, that was, that, that's the impression that you had back in the day. That was what? Yeah. <laughs> That's where the like, cheeky slash disrespectful came in. Oh. Okay. Oh. Like, um, weren't friendly, friendly, but do you know what I'm trying to say? It's weird to describe. Maybe that's his perception. Wait, of someone my, must have told you, man, this day. My perception is that you were just generally, like, sometimes you could just say some out, not outlandish, not outlandish. You could just say something that was like. Crude. What's crude? Rude. You say rude or crude? Crude. crude but What's I'm, crude? I'm pretty sure it's the same same thing. Oh. Yeah, it's rude, but it's like, it's not, but it's rude, but it's not. You get, it's, it's, it's borderline. Like mm. you, sometimes you'll cross it and sometimes you don't like, it's, you don't know in it, but like, it's just depends on the person. But the person, people never used to take it. But Literally. Like, yeah. 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 But on that note, you know, it's time to wrap up lads. Yeah, cause this camera's pissing me off. camera, right? yeah, man. I ain't got time for no wahala today, man. Technical difficulties. But yeah, man, hope you lot enjoyed this episode. Episode 56. Yeah, man, 56. Christmas special and New Year special. Let us know what you think we should do. Because we got episode on New Year's, on Christmas what? Day. And both, both days, bro. And New Year's Day as well. So they're so, dropping on both those days, isn't it? So many recommendations. Um, but yeah, man, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on the YouTube. Stay up to date on social medias. Guys, to a thousand, we're so close now, man. Come on. 15, 16 away. Yeah, man, man. so on, close man. now, man. So hopefully, you know, by this Sunday, hopefully, when you're watching this, just look at it quickly. If it's a thousand, drop a like in it. But yeah. Or comment, anything. Interactions, engagements, anything. But um, All appreciated, man. But yeah, other than that, T9 in the building. Thanks for coming, man. Thank you. It's be a boy, Hustle Out Hustle. Stay with the hustling, my people. Stay, mm, with, stay it, with it. Spin your word, Benzo in the booth. Benzo. And we'll see you on the next one still.